Rum, bum, 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 bum. Uh, stream should be going. Ahem. Yes. Good. Good, 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 good. Welcome back to Balotro. We got Purple Steak this time. I've never played Purple Steak, but I did unlock it last stream. Let's just go over the steaks real quick. Starting from white, base difficulty. We got Red Steak, where Small Blind gives no reward money. Green Steak, where their scores are higher. Black Steak has Eternal Jokers, which may be a buff. Uh, some Jokers can't be sold or destroyed. Blue Steak is minus one discard, which is pretty tough, but manageable. And then Purple Steak increases the scores even further. Even further to what? I don't know. Never played this before. Let's Zodiac deck check this out, and we'll see if I can get a run going. Do I want a Rare Joker? I don't know, it might suck. But I mean, kinda. You know what? No, I'm just gonna play it. I think I want to see as many shops as possible. That's a really good starting hand, huh? Uh, no discard spent, just one-shotting it. Alright. Love to see it. What do we get? Um, I could get some money. Do I farm? I probably do farm the money. Hone could be nice. Um, I should be able to get by with this. Yeah, I should be fine. Get a little money joker in here. Definitely not taking double tag right now. So two pair. I got a pair of sixes. Uh, do I really want to break up the flush draw? I think I'm going to go for as many money hands as possible. So I'm going to spend all four of my hands if the game is kind enough. So that means discarding like this. Just give me another pair. That's a three of a kind. Okay. Um, awkward. Surely, let's see. We'll get rid of tens. Get rid of sevens. I'll keep eight. Uh, no, I'll get rid of the other six. Um, yeah, I'm going to try to play four hands. Of course, there's a chance I just choke and lose here, but, you know, it is what it is. Okay. <laughs> Damn it. I hate passing up a full house. It's so good. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, okay, let's hope my greed doesn't extinct me. I've never actually played like this. I've never gotten this early of a to-do list. Oh, well, okay. Uh, I am not getting another hand. I am looking for a nine or an ace, which also could extinct me, or just a heart. Well, there is seven of nines and aces and five hearts, so I guess I'm looking for a nine or ace. I'd probably score higher anyway. No more discard. Yeah, four of a kind, I don't expect myself to get so early. Uh, hopefully I don't die. I had four to a flush. All right, so that was definitely too greedy. There is a chance I still come out okay, but it's not great. I don't know if this gets there. It might actually. It might be like two off or something stupid. <laughs> oh, I said there's a joke. I didn't expect it to actually be two off. Okay, don't be that greedy. <laughs> oh, that's very funny. All right, this time I'm actually going to take a free shop. And I'll carry on here. Hit a full free. That was so funny. <laughs> oh my god. All right. Well, I guess I'm playing two hands now. <laughs> I guess it's better to lose early than it is to lose late when it comes to it. Um, I could lose on this one too. If I don't get a full house here. Oh, that's bad. Oh, shit. Should I have gone for a flush? I didn't even stop to think about it. I just kind of took the full house for granted. Damn it! I'm gonna fail on two big blinds. Very sad. <laughs> uh, still savable, but I have to get lucky now. Okay, am I more likely to get a straight? There's two queens and three sevens, so five cards to dig for versus four. But it gets me. It doesn't actually get me that many, that fewer points. Well, well, well. Okay. Smart to pivot here. Let's uh, play like this. All right. So one good hand should get me out of here. It just needs to be decent. Like two pairs, I think, gets there. It better. Let me double check. Make sure I'm not passing up anything. Yay! 
Good thing I have the free shop. Okay, so. This is actually a really good shop. Too bad I can't afford to grab her. Uh, one more hand would have made a difference in some locations. But anyway, this is pretty nice. I can get a full house. I always go for full houses anyway. Having one fewer discard is actually what's hurting me. I think I'm not fully appreciating how brutal one fewer discard is. I may just take high card here. Go for full house or high card. Um, this is a foil photograph. This was actually a nut shop. Um, unless if I want to go for consistency, take some straights and flushes. I think high card is smart in case if I'm going for high card build. Because I'm starting to get to the territory where it might make sense to go for high card build. So I'm kind of hedging my bets here. Okay, here it's straight or flush. Um, cool. Well, between the two, I think I like... I kind of like the straight, but I also like the flush. I mean, let's see, I've hit one straight, no flushes so far. Also, no full houses, what the fuck? Straights kind of just happen, so I'll take it. Um, and that's the shop. Heart cards are debuffed. But I am playing full house in any circumstance. I guess I just win here, so don't even overthink it. Love to see it. Oh, the banana went away right away! <laughs> Terrifying. Well, at least I have photograph. Uh, misprint could make up for it. That could at least give me some decent stuff. Um, do I buffoon pack? Possibly. Hmm. I do like Buffoon Pack. I don't like losing one point of interest, but I mean, this is generally still worth it. I may need it straight. Oh, Abstract Joker is wonderful. Yeah. I'm not gunning for straights in particular, so I might as well just take consistency. Now I'm safe. I don't need upgrade pairs. Just look for shops. Um. Yeah. Also look for the full house. Any full house just wins. Maybe two pair wins. Maybe. Um, I'm going to play two pair. It might just win. So I guess I'm not too worried. What am I going to get rid of? Six or four? I'll get rid of a four. Plus I also got the photograph for a little bit extra. No, it just wins. Nothing to worry about. Misprints I kind of hate because sometimes it fucks you, sometimes it doesn't. Joker stencil, if I buy it, I could get rid of like photograph and just have it be a times two. I could also buy Pluto. Oh wait, Joker stencil included. Wait, no, this is a times two as is. I could sell photograph and make it a times three, but it's foil, so I don't really want to sell it. I am going to buy this. I'm just kind of... Uh, do I need it for early game? That's the thing, right? I don't know, it could be fun. <laughs> <laughs> and then just level up high card more. <laughs> uh, it could work. I'm not playing high cards, but I still could. It hurts. Mm, does it hurt? Um. Holy shit, Mike Tyson! Wow, the real Mike Tyson. From Mike Tyson. <laughs> oh, Tyler, Dude, you thank you. That's very generous of you. Appreciate it. Um, because so, let's see, I have no allegiances. I could just go high card. It's not like I'm actually actively working towards a non-high card build. So I might as well go high card for consistency. Now I'm really hating that I couldn't afford grabber, but it is what it is. I think it's good for safety. Okay, so I got two pair already, but it can get better. It did not get better. It can hopefully just be fine. Ace I have two of, nine I have three, six I have three, that means I get rid of the ace. Let's see what I get. Nope, oh, got it. Crushed it. Okay, so hallucination could help. Eh, I might just start saving money. Oh, uh, mail rebate is eternal. I can't vibe with that. 
I'm willing to just let it sit this time. None of these are that crazy. Hallucination just pisses me off because it never hits when I want it to. And I'm holding a grudge on it, so I'm going to let it sit. All right, so let's just see if I can get out in one hand. Okay, I'll keep the sixes over the threes. No, I've already seen a six go goodbye, so it's less likely I'll get a six. There we go. Full house. Nice. Yeah, misprint's also annoying. It's I, I can't really know what I score because misprint has so much variability. Uh, hone is okay. I may just... Mm, do I go judgment to get rid of misprint? Possibly, depending on what I get. Um, It seems like a good time. Oh, okay. I'm going to complain a little bit. I really wish. It's anti-3, okay? It's anti-3. I have the anti-3 voucher. It would be so helpful if now I could see what comes up in anti-3. I feel like adding that wouldn't ruin the game at all. I feel like that'd just be a very, um, very pleasant experience. I don't know if that's something that's gonna change eventually. It feels like that would be really, really nice. Uh, just at least so I could, well, okay, I can find out in other ways, um, what the score's gonna be, right? Um, no. There is a way, I don't remember how, it doesn't matter. Um, I think mostly for the boss plan. Let's be real, that's why I want to know it. Um, I'm probably gonna just try judgment, see if I hit. Face cards. Uh, photograph is interesting, but it's like first played face card. I actually may sell this because it, the odds are I'm probably playing one face card. It doesn't always happen. Um, and photograph realistically is a plus six at best in red malt. Collection blinds. Thank you. The base value. So 3,600 base. Cool. Um, yeah, this is a plus six. And this just turns a sometimes plus six into an always plus six. So that is pretty sellable. I always spent $1 on that. I'll just let it ride. Don't need Mega Arcanas. First hand is drawn face down. Very sad. Oh, that's really sad. I'm probably just going to have to spam high card when it comes to it. Okay. I'm very close to a straight. So I'll dig for tens. Too bad it's only tens. I actually may be better off going for a flush. Yeah, dealing, getting two cards out of the ten in the deck, I think is more likely than getting one card out of the four in the deck. So I think a flush actually has better odds. Although straight has better points, but I think I get there regardless. Part of me wants to just play this. But I won't. I'll play high card as a backup. Okay, now I'm closer to a full house. Um, three cards in the deck, though, that I would need. As opposed to two of ten. So I think I'd rather go 2 of 10. <laughs> okay, it's just not happening. Well, let's find out what a high card can do for me. Unless I want to play a pair. I mean, I could just play a pair. And just say, screw the photograph. Yeah, what does this actually get me? Unless I want to sell this. Uh, partly for interest, and then partly for Joker stencil. I'm, oh, then I lose the chips, though. Plus 50 chips is, no, 50 chips is cracked. 50 chips is actually like a times three in its own right. So that's 2,300. Good to know. So I can just win now no matter what. Yeah, if I'm playing high cards, plus 50 chips is really good. Um, if I'm not playing hard cards, it's less good. However, Fibonacci suddenly makes photograph a lot better. Uh, blackboard is really good too. Interesting. Um, I think I can make blackboard work. I just play all the red cards. Uh, so I'm gonna get rid of misprint here. Does that mean I ever get rid of Joker stencil? I do like Fibonacci here with photograph. All right, I'm always buying this. Let's start with the obvious. I'm probably always selling misprint, but. If I buy Fibonacci right back, does that mean I just get rid of Joker Stencil? Because I guess this guy was always meant to go. And I can keep the Photograph-Fibonacci combo? I think I prefer that. 
I really have pity for Joker Stencil. Part of me really wants to get it to work one day. It just seeing the times five multiplier on it feels so good, but it also like never actually happens. It's very sad. Uh, so really, I'm just playing my red cards and discarding my red cards. Doesn't mean I'm getting a flush. Realistically, this is a high card build. Am I gonna hone? Not yet, I'm not. So, <laughs> I could almost play a heart's flush. <laughs> uh, risky, a little bit. I wonder, though... Oh, man. I wonder if I can just win right now with a high card? Joker stencil only synergizes with itself. It'd be very cool if it synergized with jokers that have holes in them. That would be very cool. <laughs> that would be very funny. All right. Uh, that's, that's a cool idea. You should pass that on. Okay, so. Um, I'm thinking about the pairs of fives. I mean, it might just win. What if it wins? I'm curious. What if it wins? This is like a really good Fibonacci hand. I don't get a bunch of photograph synergy. Yeah, it's disgusting. Okay. I think I'm just gonna play hands right now and not think about it. It's not like I need to dig through my deck for anything in particular either. I could go Hanged Man, try to get rid of trash. You know, that doesn't Fibonacci synergize. Like fours. And then I can go standard packs, just try to go Fibonacci. Let me start with you. What do you got for me? Death is excellent. So is Hierophants. Well, okay, maybe I'm not taking hand Hanged Man then. What jokers have holes in them? Uh, punch card sometimes? <laughs> uh, I don't know. They could add some jokers that have holes in it. Of course, yeah, I could also get rid of red cards. Oh, man. Alright, so I'm keeping death. Maybe I'd lose Hierophant? I'm taking Hone for sure. Um, I do want to see some foil holographic polychromes. So... Hierophant, I mean, blue chips are really good right now because I only have Photograph for it, but it's also less good in the long run than Hanged Man, and I think I can handle a short-term deficit. So I will take with that in mind. This is crazy to get three good Taros. Standard pack is tempting. I think I just hold on to the rest of my money. So first hand is drawn face down. That's very sad. Um, but actually it's not that sad, because I'm just gonna discard a ton of cards, and then discard again. Ugh, it's all reds! <laughs> oh no! Alright, let's get rid of the ones that don't have Fibonacci synergy. I know I'll get rid of a face card, but whatever. Please? Okay, this can work. I can play King of Hearts. Um, I can get rid of a 4, I can get rid of a 6. I can use Death to turn things into 8s of spades. Well, then I could just play a pair of eights instead. Either way, I'm going to use both my taros in hopes that I get them back. So, four is worthless. Even though it's black, six is worthless. Unless I want to lose the king. Well, yeah, half joker and photograph. The only way that actually I'm going to get value out of both is by, like, two pair. So, I wonder if I keep the four. I could also just play a... Str no, no. Like, I, I could get rid of the King of Hearts, is what I'm saying. But then I don't Hanged Man. Oh, man. So, I'm definitely turning something into eight. How greedy do I want to get? Yeah, I, I do win here pretty much no matter what. I wonder if Photograph will just be out the door. I could see it. Just try to go for Fibonacci's instead. Photograph and Misprint. Eventually, I'll get a better Chips Joker, right? Yeah, I think I need to admit I will get a better Chips Joker at some point, so I can lose stuff like this. Uh, then I'll probably lose the 4 and 6. So, we go like this. And then, I'm gonna get rid of you 2 Because this is the only way I can actually play all the hand. So I can go pair and three red cards. Perfect. 
Alright, so photographs on the chopping block, followed by misprints. I only got 9,000, but that was a boss. Celestial pack. Um, what am I playing the most of? Pairs, somehow. I don't know if I want a gun for that. I may just sit here. Let it ride. Uh, yeah, there's nothing here that's like, have to get, must do. Base value, I think, is like 10,000, if I remember right, which I didn't get. Which is a little sketch. Um, but I guess I can just win in two hands and I'll be okay. Do I want 12 bucks? I think I'd rather just see another shop. Right, so, get rid of reds. Eight, good. I could keep around the jack, get rid of the four. Okay, I could just play a flush in black if I'm lucky. Let's hope that I don't draw any more reds. Oh wait, I'm missing a spade. Well, let's hope that, ooh, I could just play a full house. <laughs> uh, let's not overthink this. Just disgusting win. Okay, that's, that's good. This is kind of an anything build, huh? It's just the best hand available. We're gonna definitely Emperor. Am I gonna High Priest this? I don't really know what Terra's I want. I think I'm actually gonna buy Emperor, go into Arcana Pack, and start going for Fibonacci. Just make everything a black Fibonacci if possible. Ooh, ooh, okay. All right, uh, I wanted to potentially use Emperor here. Um, but I actually, I'm gonna use Hermit. I wanted to play it like, well, if I'm going Hermit, there's actually not much I want to do with Fibonacci. Yeah, there's the Red Queen, Sevens, Kings, but they're okay. Um, so I'm obviously going to Hermit. I may just Emperor afterwards in hopes to get Hermit again, and then I can save this for during the fight. So let's use it now. Uh, okay, another Emperor. Excellent. Star is getting sold every time. All right, let's try this again. <laughs> Wheel of Fortune. Woo. Anything? Nope. Steel card is nice. Do I want to spend two bucks? I think I can go without it. And yeah, I'm not really gunning for any particular planets. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to get too many manipulators. Um, even, Steven, meh. Let's just play. So, gonna get rid of reds, and otherwise, um, uh, maybe you, maybe a club's flush could be possible. Two queens, two twos, I may just go for two pair, or just discard these, or I could just dig for a flush. Yeah, but it's unlikely that I'll be able to play off any red cards, so this is probably safer. Yeah, I could go two pair. Uh, I am gonna chariot something that sits in my hand. So something like a ten of clubs is a pretty good target. Six, I think it's gonna be trashed eventually. Yeah, so black cards are getting steeled, red cards are never. That card is almost better. Almost. Yeah, steals are really good with Fibonacci. I mean, I, that was plus 10 red. Hmm. Suits. Uh, hmm. This would really make it red versus black. Is it necessary? I mean, I can play more flushes, yes. Um, but the thing is, I, I'm not playing flushes, because if I'm getting red cards out of the hand, that realistically means I'm playing them. Um, so what good does a flush build actually do for me? I think I'd rather just go standard packs, take some good stuff. I forget, does the stone card fuck up blackboard? If I turn a red card into a stone card and leave it in hand for some reason, does blackboard say, fuck you, you get nothing? Alright, so Ace is the best. Glass, too bad is glass, actually. Foil would have been nice. 
It has no suit, so that means it fucks Blackboard. Ace of Spades is good. Fibonacci and Blackboard. See if I can get more of this. Wow, um, huh. I like the purple seal. It's a shame that it's on, like, a card that I like to play. I don't have any discards, though. Um, five of hearts is good because I want to play it because of Fibonacci. And it has plus 50 chips. Like, that's a really good five of hearts, but also a good two of clubs. Uh, purple seal is really good, especially considering what I'm trying to go for. Uh, so I'm going to take the purple seal in hopes I get deaths and hanged mans. And here, I think I actually will reroll once, see if I hit anything. I did not. Mail and rebates, not worth it to me. I'm not trying to celestial pack, so I will keep coasting. Diamond cards are debuffed. Neat. Okay, so I got two threes. Five and four I'll lose. Um, otherwise, what do I ditch here? Maybe just these two? Okay, I got my two, actually. Lucky me. I'm gonna get rid of these guys as well, and then hope that the rest is good. High Priestess, might as well just use it now. I could sell one of them. Oh, use High Card, sell Flush. This is worth $2. This is almost cracked. I might just go for three of a kind here. I think that's, yeah, three of a kind should win. I don't see why it wouldn't. Definitely keep it for the Blackboard. Hate pass up a full house, but three of a kind's not bad. Love it. Only barely getting by, but I mean, you know, a win is a win. And high card is probably still great. Huh. Uh, Overstock Plus is always happening. Do... Well, I mean, Polychrome is excellent. Straits. I guess I never even thought about that. Hmm. What do I have with Straits? I bought a planet for them. Polychrome is excellent. I think I have to buy it for the Poly alone. Like, it's better than Photo... Mm, is it better than the photograph? It's probably better than misprint. Plus 50 chips still goes a long way. Yeah, plus 50 chips is still like a times 1.5 at minimum. Oh, also there's card sharp. Wait, card shop? What the fuck? Holy shit, I can play high cards now. High card build. Um, wow. I actually might lose both photograph and misprint then. Mm, but I'm missing out on blue chips. Ugh, I need blue chips. I am very, 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 very blue chip poor. Mis misprint is always going. Um, card sharp for sure. I almost am tempted... No, I have to go... No, no, wait, 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 wait. If I just keep getting... Um, leveling up high card, that could be my blue chips. So I actually go for the fool as well. I buy I buy everything in this damn shop. I buy the whole fucking thing. Maybe even the celestial pack too. Except um, telescope would have gotten me pair stuff. All right. So fuck misprint always. Um, card shop for sure. And then yeah, I say I lose photograph. I'm not even doing the straights. It's just like you know times 1.5. It's good. Bind use Pluto. You know, I mean, I also could hit the straight every now and then. And that's good, don't get me wrong. I think I'm even gonna just buy this now. Um, yeah, I think I'll actually sack the money for this. I lose two bucks, but potentially I get four new look at things. Like, this is a free shop. I could take another Pluto. I think that's worth it. Yeah, just being able to see more things immediately. Like, I effectively lose on $2 per round. No, not per round, because I was going to buy it next time, no matter what. Um, I lose out on $2. I think that's worth it. It's like a really cheap reroll, basically. Alright, so now I... <laughs> that's a lot of fives. Uh, <laughs> oh, man. Uh, hold on. I'm probably going to play four of a kind here. Just getting rid of... Uh... Uh, these first. That wins, right? Four of a kind. It has a lot of chips. Okay, that's pretty good. Surely this wins.
It did not. Okay, well, at least I got my purple seal, so that works out. Maybe I'm just better off playing high card. Spades. Oh, spades. Excellent. That's a good one. Well worth it. Um, so I'm playing a high card here. And then... Unless I want to flush. I should know what high card gets me. I, sh I should know... Because I know it's going to win anyway. I might as well just, like, send it. Eight thousand. So the second one is, like, twenty-five thousand. And then the third one's also twenty-five thousand. On and on. Eternal DNA. Well, if I'm playing high cards already, I actually might give it a shortcut for that. Or just make a shit ton of aces. One sec, I gotta blow my nose. There is a downside to DNA. Um... Well, okay, there's a lot of thoughts I have. Downside to DNA is I can't ever sell it, and there will come a point where it's just taking up a spot. If I'm playing high card, DNA doesn't fucking matter. Um, here's what I'm actually thinking about right now. Fibonacci is a plus 8. Abstract is a plus 15. These guys are going to have to be better. Shortcut is at times 1.5. I'm sure that can be better as well. I think I'm just looking for things to replace these. And I'm playing a bunch of high cards. So really... I guess I'm just gonna save money and hope I eventually find stuff that gets me high card synergy. So, of course, uh, if I don't play high cards, I could just go and win. Uh, let me let me just. Mm, yeah, hold on. I should... Even though, like, my eventual plan is to play a bunch of high cards, it doesn't necessarily mean that I do it now. Ideally, if I can help it, I still try to go out in one turn. Uh, so I'm gonna dig for an Acer 8. Dig for an Acer 8. No, I'm not gonna play the flush. Um, well, didn't hit it. I can play like this, at least I got my 10. Also dig for the twos at any point in time. 17,000. Hmm. Well, now I gotta play this. So that's 7,000. Next one's a good one. Didn't hit it, or hit it too late. Very sad. So this is the good hand. Time three multi on final hand of round. Tempting. Let's see. Times 1.5 multi on all hands or times three on last hand? I think times 1.5 on all hands is better. Um, is it though? Well, better than what? I, w I could lose Fibbo? Mm. I don't know. I, I need blue chips. That's what I'm looking for. I'm looking for um, Stuntman, basically, which is not a good strategy to be digging for one Joker. There's a few other Jokers, I'm sure, that can help here. Basically, I'm dig also maybe digging for just more high card levels. Fibonacci right now is a plus 8 multiplier. Like, I'm looking for blue chips. I gotta have Abstract Joker to actually get the mult going, but eventually Fibu will be sold for a blue chip guy, and I think if I do that, I just win. Right? Sell Fibu for blue chip, and then 
level up high card and then win. Arcana packs could be okay. Like, I may actually even get one here. Just in hopes that I get a money one or something else. Or molt cards, actually. Um, molts on aces. Or Wheel of Fortune. Gold cards, not bad either. Hmm. I actually am thinking of wheel just because I can't guarantee I'll draw up either of these. Like, I don't draw much with my deck. Alright, please. Very sad. I'm willing to sit here. I actually prefer it this way, and I'm just gonna start playing high cards. Oh, but I don't know what these are. Okay, I have to discard face cards, discard red. I'm probably playing that ace. Yeah, just discard like this. No, too late. Okay, so just play high cards. Sort by suit. Ah. Play high cards and then start popping off. I'm gonna play just the ace here. And there we go, 25k. And another 25-ish K. Cool. One dollar. Hermit's really nice. Fortune Teller is better than Abstract. Uh, Tarot Tycoon goes with Fortune Teller. I guess it just does great. I think the play here is... Oh, no, I first get rid of Fibonacci. Duh. Let's be honest. This is always the play. I mean, the, the, the it plays itself, I think, here. Always get this. Always get the Arcana. Steel card's good. Uh, probably put that on a two, huh? Too bad I can't get rid of those reds. Unless I want to go for a stone and just play the stone with high card. If I'm going high card, stone becomes way better. Wait, this is cracked, actually. Yeah, I like the stone more I think of it. More I think about it. Yeah, plus 50 chips is like times 1.5 on the whole thing. Chariot is really just like a plus three, plus six, I think. Plus six. Yeah, this is this is great. Take stones. I still play it. Uh, I guess I'm digging for a high card planet. I'm willing to spend the money. Didn't hit it, that's okay. Full house, whatever. Uh, we are chilling. 50k, I can get 50k easily. 100k though might be a bit tough. We will see. I oh, don't know, I got fortune teller. It's pretty cracked. Alright, so Fibonacci does not matter anymore. Uh, we're gonna start with digging for the blue, uh, red seal. Yeah, dig for the, uh, not, sorry, red seal, purple seal and steel cards. Yeah, so we dig. Didn't hit it. That's okay. I think I'll just discard these. I was hoping for the steel. Didn't hit it. Okay, so now I play these. Wait, no. Save this for the big hand. So I just play this now to get the ball roll rolling. And then play like this. Yeah, because I don't have to worry about Fib anymore. What does it get me? Oh, that's cracked. Okay, 50k per hand. Yeah. Stone practic was nearly a times two. Okay, death is excellent here. Um, and, of course, Arcanas. So now I want a lot of stones if I can help it. Um, oh. Ooh, okay, the Fool seems good. I might take more steals... Um, well, that's just okay. The world is okay as well. I honestly, I'm getting rid of red cards just fine. So, 
damn shame, though, I didn't have the stone come up, because I really wanted to fool. Otherwise, I'd have to go, like... Oh, man. I mean, I can always spend a death now than just get a second death. It's better than the other options, so I would just take more steals. What would I get rid of then? Uh, Jack of Hearts, that's fine. Yeah, seems good to me. Just double checking. Everything seems fine. And then, yeah, I mean, this also gets me more Fortune Teller synergy. Uh, keep death around. We'll see. Another Fool or Hermit. I may like Hermit more, uh, but more Death Fool. Uh, I just can't seem to get the the stone. I guess it's another death for death. Thanks, Sonny, for the tip. I, I do like Fool even more. Uh, do I like it more than $13? I mean, that helps out Fortune Teller and scaling's great. But it is $13. Man, that's... It's either <laughs> plus one multi or $13. Because, let's be honest, one death here does nothing. It's not even like I'm getting another steal. So I guess I take the Hermit. Yeah, $13 is better than one malt. Uh, and then I can get maximum interest, so I guess I chill. I should be able to get 75000 And I look for the stone card. Heavy dig for it. Do I find it? Come on. No, but I guess I... Uh, do I take another tarot? I think I would prefer a second stone. The second tarot might be too slow. It is tempting. Too bad I don't have a red hit with this. I I may just need to spend a death in hopes that I get another death. So, it's a shame there's no reds to hit here. Suffering from success a little bit. Alright, here, uh, I just need to get the ball rolling. So, it can be trash. We can just play like this. I can still dig for stone. Like this. Yeah, dig for stone. I think that's the play. And dig for steel. Well, I get 12k on a trash hand. Okay. Noted. Dig for the stone. There's the stone. Welcome. Alright, so that does 65k. Stones are so good. I would sacrifice Abstract Joker for the one that adds stones to my deck. Uh, both Emperor and Hanged Man are cracked. Um, so here's what's up. I'm going into the Arcana Pack, but I'm not going to go in there right away. Because I'm going to buy some of these Tarot's first. Um, to almost get them out of the pool. Um, now this is this is um, kind of interesting, because like... I think it's smart to just buy both of these and then use them in the Arcana pack. I think that's the play. Oh, and I have death, excellent, okay. So, I'll start by getting rid of some trash. I'm gonna use death before Emperor in hopes to get a second death. Did not get stone. That's okay. I have 26 bucks again. I can get 100,000, so I'm not too worried. Do I Mega Celestial? Glass, planets. I guess I'll use both. I actually may do this. Excuse me. Uh, how many planets are there? There's nine. So five out of the nine ones show up. 
And plus, actually gaining a second planet is worthless to me. I think I just sit and hope the High Priestess gets me there. Fuck spades, all my homies hate spades. Okay, so... I got, like, a lot of good stuff here. Let's start with, um, turning a red into glass, I guess. Yeah, I can do that, and we'll hope that I hit for, um, high card. Oh, I hit! Love it. I can sell the other one. And then, dig... There's only one stone. Did I hit everything? I hit everything except for one steel. I'm dis- Oh, I disc- I'm looking for the other tarot, I guess? I guess that does mean I just discard this. And screw the whole- uh, Maybe I'll break it eventually sort of thing. But I'm just digging for best possible op outcomes. And it shouldn't really matter- Well, I hit that. So now, if I find that other red- Seal, I guess, doesn't really change much. I guess I'll discard this for sure. Uh, does debuff cards fuck with blackboard? That's a great question. Does anyone know? I could discard just to be sure. I'll even discard this, huh? Well, actually, no, the only other... What is it? Alright, what I'm looking for is a target for the devil. Found it. Just want to get this out of the way. So, here... Do I even care if the first hand has blackboard? I'm really tempted to just, like... Well, it doesn't matter. I don't think it matters. Yeah, I'll draw something and then I'll play it. Yeah, and then the next hand will pop off anyway. I can always high card with stone if weird stuff happens. So, let's see. I got you and you and you. What does this get me? <laughs> oh, 100k in one hand. And I had still two hands to go, so my ceiling is like 300k. Um, blue chips. It's anti-7. Damn it! <laughs> it's too late! Ah. Uh, Green Joker is okay. It's also too late for Green Joker, I think. Well, I could just never discard again, which is sad for the purple chips. And I would surpass Abstract Joker in Anti-8. It's also too late, I think. Let me go to Options, Collection, Lines. I just need to get like 360,000. Realistically to win. Uh, so I'm probably just gonna do a bunch of Arcanas and scale that way. Like, I think I'll just win with that. Unless if I want to replace Shortcut with something. Times 1.5. I don't think Square Joker will be a times 1.5 in blue. Although, it might be pretty good. Mmm, hold up. It might be. Well, let's at least try to... I'm not gonna plan that Tycoon. Let's at least start with Arcanas, up the ass. I hit Pluto, excellent, that's exactly what I was looking for. Quite lucky, sell the other one. Do the regular Arcana. Uh, the Fool for another Pluto, I think I just go for more Plutos. Yeah, if I keep scaling Pluto, that's my blue chips and I can win that way. I may even try to see if I get a cool standard card in here. There's a lot of, you know, effective things on it that can help. Red Seal. Uh, is it okay? Meh. This is basically 14 chips. If I can put a lot of stuff on it, so I might as well, like, take it. And then put, like, a steel on it. Wow, that's really good. Um, always buying Hanged Man. And always buying Tower. And then I'll chill. Excellent. Uh, so now we play. Okay, so Hangs Man to start, I think. I could just get rid of like 8 and 7. Or else oh, I could start with Tower. I could do both because I would not mind getting back either. There's not many reds here. Dude, I don't give a shit about reds. At this point, I can play anything. 
I can do anything. It's all good. So, let's start with this. I probably am gonna hang man. Um, and then... If I destroy... Could I still massively dig for stones? Yes, I can. I, even, I think I'll lose the steel. I think this is okay. Like, I'm not concerned about reds, because I can always just play them off. The odds of me getting fucked by red cards are absurdly low. Like, even now, I have three red cards in hand? Who gives a shit? I can just play them. Uh, but I'm not gonna intentionally gain more reds, so that's dumb. Come on, more stones. Didn't hit it. That is fine. I guess I'll let this hand be trash. Still dig for stones. Yeah, that's a straight. Oh, fuck. Uh, <laughs> uh <-huh>. awkward. <laughs> uh, fuck you, shortcut. I'd have to do something like this. That could work. <laughs> okay, very funny. Dig for the- well, I guess it's too late to dig for anything because I think this just wins. Oh, I didn't play the stone. Uh, I'm like, what the fuck? I didn't play the stone. No, that makes sense. Also block blackboard. Yeah, yeah, my bad. Missed out on one dollar. I'll live. Let me just double check. This is not a straight. We're chilling. Eventually, I want to get, um... Steel card on this. That's ideal. Holy shit! Uh, that's cracked? So... Um... I could come in with two hanged mans. I don't care about hanged mans as much. Hanged mans are good, but, like, they're not as good as temperance. Or I could save the fool for something like death? Yeah, this is cracked. I'm definitely using all of these. This is insane! This is all taros! All the time! Okay, sell. I genuinely think I'm gonna use Fool on something from one of these two packs. So I will buy this and then go into the pack. Fool, if I could hit Death or Stone, that is preferable. Um, I did not, but I will try again. Uh, planets, I guess, are the best options. Eight. Well, just in time to see this pop off. Assuming I don't get purple Joker, I should just win on uh, the spot. I like High Priestess the most in hopes I get Pluto. So let's do it. Oh, I got it! Yes, huge. Well, I actually might fool into Pluto. Pluto's really good too. Ooh, Pluto might be better than Stone. Ooh. Okay, it's not that it might be better than stone, it's more that my odds of getting a stone are low. Fuck, Pluto's really good. No, Fool would still be better on death or stone, I think. Death is really good too. Yeah, 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 yeah take the death. Let's sell this. I got death. Excellent. Okay, did not get it on a stone, but at least I can get a second death. Because at least I can death a stone. Um, and having a steel is good as high card levels up. That does make steels better and better. Oh, I'm using death. Or having death. Um, but what I'm actually going to do is reroll, see if I hit death. I did not. Uh, let's use this right now. I'm going to Wheel of Fortune because of the Fortune Teller buff, and maybe it hits. 
There's also technically merit to using star on a red card for the fortune teller buff, which makes my selling of this in the past less good. I don't know if I'd buy it for $3, but if I keep, get a star in the future, I think I'd rather use it than save $1. So that's how I'm going to play this. All right. Not going to go Mega Arcane. I think I'm just going to see more shops. Okay. Do I death for a purple seal? Especially since I have it right now. Damn it. Ugh, but then less stones. I think it's purple seal. Okay, well, death is versatile. This could give me more stones. <laughs> if I am lucky. I'm gonna play like this. Discard these. More death. Okay, so this time I got star. I am gonna use it. Devil's okay. Uh, I'm not gonna put devil on the red seal. I'm saving this for a chariot. In hopes that I get it. However, the odds of me getting a chariot are also low. I might just run it. Or stone? If I do stone, do I keep the red seal? Alright, well, I didn't hit. So I will play like this then. Do it now, because it, well, didn't get any better. Um, I think I'll just win on two. What am I worried of? Not much. Do I win with two hands? What am I digging for? Steals? Another stone? I'm not too concerned about reds. I think I can play this many cards. Yeah, I think I can afford to dig. Yeah, I also have other... Yeah, I have stuff I, worth digging for. Okay. Didn't hit any of it, but play both of these. And just in case there's something left, I can dig. Ba -ba 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 -ba. So as good as it's going to get. Okay, banger. Yeah, so three hands like that means a minimum guarantee of 450,000, which means that as long as I don't... Oh my, holy shit. As long as I don't get the, um... The Violet boss. Vi yeah, Violet boss. I was thinking violent. I should be good. Uh, Emperor, I think I might just buy without using. Save that so I can bring in two taros. It's this guy again. Actually... Well, I mean, this would probably guarantee I beat Violet Boss. I'd lose Abstract Joker. Abstract is only a times 1.25 at this point. So that does make this guy better. Yeah, this is a times 1.25. Times 3 once is better than times 1.25. Basically three times. Acrobat. Um, I'm going to dig for Pluto. Hmm. Or I could keep re-rolling. Say, screw glass card, look for better taros. Kind of like that more. At first, is only okay. I think I'm going to look for better. No. At some point, maybe I should just buy Empress, Empress so I have it. Just to use it as a tarot and it's, you know, fine for plus molt. And we'll see if I hit anything. Okay, I got Temperance. And Strength is... Mmm! Uh, plus 50 chips. Makes stones really good, huh? I might lose Shortcut for it. We Joker is too light. Also, I haven't discovered it. I might be able to get away with this. This is a times 1.5. This is a times... Uh, 1.5 at best, but it gets better with every single Joker. So this is between like a times 1.2 and a times 1.5. But it scales. And all I need is like one more death on the stone or just another stone. But then is it shortcut or acrobat? What's better? Times 1.5 three times or is times three once? 
Well, technically both. Like, they scale with each other. I kind of want to get this purely because of the unlock. And I think I can win with any combination of these three. I'm pretty sure I can. Yeah, so 1.5, and then add it to another one. Mm, how does it work if I times 1.5 twice? So 100,000, 100,000, 100,000 um, versus, which would be, or 100, 100, 100. It'd be 150, 150, 150 versus 113. 113 is higher. That adds up to 5. This adds up to 4.5. So I guess it's going to be shortcut that goes. Although I, technically there's the fourth hand, but the fourth hand is so insignificant, it might as well mean nothing. And I certainly don't want to accidentally get a straight. <laughs> Why do I feel like I'm going to lose if I accidentally get a straight? Um... Because, yeah, a mathematically three times once is higher than times 1.5 three times. But it is close. Um, so I'll sell you. I don't want to accidentally get a straight. And then I'm digging. For stones. Meh. 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 Um... Fuck. Okay, I guess I'm selling the Empress here. Just give me a second. I want to if I want a full Emperor. I'm going to sell Empress here. I'm just debating on whether I want Tempress or Emperor. Both are really good, actually. Um, although if I get Temperance, then I could, um, buy more Joker, or buy more Taros, look, dig even more. Or even buy a Buffoon Pack. Double Emperor could be really good too. Well, no, because the first Emperor would be neutered. Alright, let's we'll start by selling this. I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna use this. Excuse me. And then buy, like, strength. And maybe a celestial pack in hopes to hit. Yeah, so I'm, I'm gonna spend a bit of money right now. Just get a, a little bit of scaling. I'm not gonna reroll this time. Uh, I actually may even sit on my money and just come back with a lot of money and be prepared to spend it all. Yeah, it might be better just holding. I don't, you know, I, I'm a little inefficient with interest, but I save a lot of money. Um, so now, I'm gonna use strength on like, I don't know, a queen or two or something. I guess it doesn't really matter what I hit with this. Just so I do it. I should probably emperor right away. Just gonna think this through. Yeah, there's no purpose for strength in my deck. Um, so we go. And use. Hanged man's nice. I got strength again. Uh, the hope was to get a king into an ace. That was kind of the main thing. Because then it's a usable face card. Or non-face card. Of course. Uh, I'm probably just going to destroy it. <laughs> uh... Technically, keeping around the aces are better, but I also don't want too many aces. So I'll just hanged man. And then look for stuff. Dig, 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 dig. D strength again! Yo, maybe I should just hold my strengths. <laughs> this is what's gonna keep happening. Amazing. Incredible. Dig. 
Ah, there's that. Okay. So, we'll start with just a little high card. Dig for stones. It's good to actually have perma stone in my deck. That was 33,000. Wow. That's pretty cracked. Just let me check something. Everything is good here. Are we just $5 pop? and 69 cents from Zenacola. My cat Fred has arrived to watch. Ah, welcome Fred the cat. Hope you enjoyed that big money. That was big money. Uh, glass card, no. Okay, so I'm definitely clearing sailing and then just buy, buy, buy. Probably get a celestial pack. Hanged man. I don't know if I'll do a celestial pack. I'll I'll sit on that. I will do this. We heal the fortune. I guess I'll try. Come on, big money. Holy shit! Ooh, chips too. Nice. Okay, chips are appreciated. I think I'll even reroll once more. Alright, didn't hit much. I might just buy a wild card on something that I'm about to destroy just to... I'd spend $2 for plus one malt. It's worthwhile. Just double checking. One random joker disabled each hand. That's a scary one, but I think doable? Because I have multiple times threes. We'll see. It'll be tough. It will be tough. I need to scale as much as this will let me. Uh, so I'm going to start with... Lovers? Uh, let's just use it on this. Bam, bam. Actually, may get rid of the 10. Do I have too many 10s? I have too many 10s. So it's actually in my favor to get rid of some 10s. Just to ensure that I can always play high card. Nice, got this. That's fine. Death! Okay, I need a stone, please. Um... Save this for a stone. Ah, damn it. I might go for steel instead of purple seal. It might be too late for purple seal to pay off. Unless, if, I want to just save this for a stone. I think I actually am better off saving this for a stone. Because now there's not much time left in the run overall. I think you just take the guarantee. Um when the boss comes. Like, I think it's better to be safe there. Wow, that one. Jeez. <laughs> Emperor, definitely a spectral. There's a lot this- Oh, I got stoned. Oh no, that's the downside of not using death! Fuck! Uh, well, I'm taking tower over Emperor. Uh, tower death is disgusting. And I'm probably going to play them both. Well, I could also save it for the boss. But I'm going to Spectral, probably Celestial. See what happens. Anything good here? Meh. Meh. Two copies of No Stones. Um, Ecto is pretty good. Ecto is really good because I don't give it that much of a shit about hand size. It's technically moderately worse. And I didn't hit Stone. Uh, two of Clubs is too late. Oh, I could have bought the stone! Oh, wow. I didn't even think about that as a possibility. I only think about um, being able to use taros during uh, tarot packs. That's a shame. Yeah, that would have been a correct play. I just never thought about that as a possibility. So, Ecto's the play. Then I can pick up any Joker. Very sad. <laughs> on the stone. And I am actually going to Celestial Pack here. I might hit. It's only three bucks. I'll be okay. Even if it whiffs. Whatever. I'll hit a... What, do I, what am I most likely to do accidentally? A pair, probably? Alright. I'm gonna buy Tower, and then I'm gonna 
Reroll once, actually. I couldn't even go popcorn. Just to have something. This would be a times, like, 1.25 against the boss. I could probably do better. Yeah, I could probably do better. Can I? I don't know. Plus 16 molt is might be hard to beat. Even though, like, it's not insane, it's just something. This is not the last shop. There's one more shop. Um, one more shop probably means that plus 16 is a fair pick. Uh, I actually am going to death tower this time. If nothing else, uh, but for Stone Joker. I'm not going to do it right away. But I will. Uh, but I could also save it for the boss. I might just save it for the boss. No, oh, I got a purple. Ah, fuck. Maybe I death now? And I could save tower for later? I could save tower for later, um, but then again, this, like, what are the odds of me getting some better? It might just be smart to play safe. Yeah. I think I'm a big fan of playing safe. Because I can guarantee that I would have, um, two towers in my hand against the final, or two stones in my hand against the final boss. I'm not going to lose accidentally, right? Yeah, I, okay. So my next shop is really just going to be entirely looking for something better than popcorn. Guaranteeing two stones in my hand next time is awesome. Um, in that case, I should just play like this. Uh, I'm actually just going to play and not even discard. And then start popping off. Well, no, no, no. That's a lie. I'm going to discard. Look for the other stone right now. Maybe I hit it, maybe I don't. Alright, shit hand here. Yeah, because the only thing I'm concerned about is the boss, especially when I draw two stones here. Amazing. Double check, I'm not accidentally fucking myself. Alright, so two stones, what that hand will do for me, is going to be even better than this. But 242,000, it's funny that it doesn't win yet, but we haven't had acrobats. Uh, that'll be even better with Stone Joker, because I'll have plus another 50 chips. I could also maybe hit on the 10. See if I'm lucky. Do, does it break? It does not break. That's fine. Okay, so now that... Wow, I got this. Lots of Arcanas. We'll start with the packs. Or maybe I'll start with the rerolls. Abstract is better than popcorn. Funny to see I come back. Shoot the moon. Uh, I can't rely on having queens in hand. It just seems annoying. But this is better. Moderate improvement. Hanged man. No. 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 Wheel of Fortune. Holy shit, it hit <laughs> on the abstract. Okay, this is looking very good. I think I'm just wheeling again. <laughs> uh, it seems to be a lucky run for the wheel. No. Come on, wheel. A chariot on seven of clubs. Excellent. Perfect. That's exactly what I was hoping for. Well worth it. Yo, Duple, thank you for the 20. You alone have gotten me into so many puzzle and roguelike games, it's insane. Keep it up, Browski, much love. Cheers. Alright, so next, we're getting a shit ton of stones. What do you got for me, Crimson Heart? Oh no, the Acrobat's disabled. How oh, terrible. On the non-last hand. Alright, so everything's coming together. Can I hit something, please? I hit a stone. That's fine. So I'm still not gonna use... Well, I, I might as well. Oh, no, no, no. So here's how I'm gonna play this. 
I'm still gonna maximum dig, let this hand be shit, uh, as always, and then see what gets hit. Then I will use the taros during the good hand, but I have to maximum dig first. Okay, so maximum dig. Aw, uh, stone joker, very sad. But now we go in. Now we go in. So now we tower the three. And then I death probably just the two. And let it ride. Now I don't get that bonus, so it's not going to be incredible. But I still play it like this uh, because it's my best hand and I want to play my best hands. So, yeah. Let it be good. What does this even get me? 317. Oh, I'm not losing here. You just, you don't lose these. It doesn't happen. It's over. It's over. Screw the card sharp. Don't care. You don't need it. GG. Alright, love to see it. Purple stake has been defeated. Next up is... What is next? The orange stake. Booster packs cost one more per ante. Ah. A scaling cost. So something that doesn't hurt you in the beginning, but does make it harder later. I actually like the idea of that. Polychrome. Uh, I will not afford that. Let's be honest. So this is actually, I feel like, a really good deck for it. Um... Looking like Stanley Yelmets with all that digging. So, this seems like an insanely good deck for this stake. Because think about it, overstock means I see more stuff in the shop. I already want to buy stuff in the shop anyway. I'm digging for a flush. Um, so that seems way better. I hit a flush, but does it actually add up? I think it actually does exactly add up. Um, no, it's going to be a bit short. I need something better. Uh, do I just keep it so I can win with two hands regardless? Well, the odds... I'll, I'll draw a heart in two hands. Yeah, perfect. There we go. Love to see it. Orange steak was a nightmare for me. Hope you have better luck. Thanks. Uh, and also, there's the voucher that has tarot show up in shops more. Tarot packs are the main things I buy, but tarot packs become less valuable if I tarot show up in shops anyway. So, that's fine. And plus, a pack's earlier still good. I could ride the bus, or I could take two random jokers. I don't want to ride the bus. It's sad. I don't know why it's sad. It's just... It's an obnoxious way to play. I think I'm taking two random jokers. Of course, this is a way to get a high card hand and just pop off. Um, the issue with this is I, uh, I guess I can easily win. Ah, oh, fuck. All right, brain rot build. We're going on the bus. So fuck the these and then dig for, I guess I could dig for a flush if I'm lucky. I actually hit it. Um, so I shouldn't win here. Um, but I gotta be careful. I'm gonna be very careful. I'm gonna play, like, three trash hands. And then a flush. But then, oh, shoot. Yeah, do I max out the bus? I guess. That's really good. I hate missing out on a ton of money. Hmm. This is another reason I hate the bus. Well, I should be able to figure this out eventually. Slavic Crusader 96. Hey, thank Hello, you. Hello, my favorite gambling addicts. How is everyone doing this Tuesday? Remember to hydrate or you'll die. Great. Yes, yeah, very important. Okay, so I still don't win with one flush. It doesn't get there. But, um, I can start with, like, a shitty hand. And then a flush? Wait, does that get me there? Hold on. Flush times five. What does this add up to? This is 27, 33, 35. 
So 70 times 5 is 350. I think I actually need to play two shit hands. Well, it could be the other way around, too. I'm just trying to think if I can get out here in two hands. What are the odds of that? Um... I could play a random ass straight to hope to draw two clubs. If I play one shit hand, it doesn't get me there. Or wait, would it be plus two molt? 70 times six is 420. Yeah, but then eight. This is gonna be 13 times two, so that doesn't cover the difference. Unless I get a better club. Or I could just three-hand it. I don't like the straight here. I don't know why, though. It's not that bad. I guess I'm just not a fan. If I play a straight, then I have to do like a totally different set of calculations. Maybe I'll get a better club. I didn't. Very sad. Okay. I'm playing three hands then. Fun. I'll hit a uh, high card just in case it matters. And down the road. So bust be scaling. My money not be scaling. Odd Todd's really good. Um, does that mean I take it? I may just be able to get by with scaling the bus and holding on to money and just mega greeting. I hate passing up on Odd Todd because it's one of my favorite jokers. Especially since I heard they're going to change it so it gives plus 31 chips instead of 30. So it's an odd number. Very cool flavor. Odd Todd is fucking excellent too. Man. Because then I can like turn all the... Um, try to turn <laughs> the um, face cards into aces and odds. It's just good. I think I should just take the good joker here and say fuck the money. And plus, this is actually going to make it more likely that I get out in one hand anyway. I guess. Um, how do I play this one? I got two pair right now. Maybe I'll just play the two pair. Hmm. I actually never thought about this. If I can get out one hand, that's ideal. So I guess a full house would be the best. Okay, I got a full house. Can I get a better full house? No. Maybe I don't get out in one hand? I do get out in one hand. That's okay, I think. Scholar with Odd Todd. Strength with Odd Todd is really good. Ice Cream is also good. A little unnecessary. Damn, I'm getting a lot of good shit. Strength is great to turn kings and aces, especially with Scholar. I actually kind of want to go Strength and Scholar. Just go for an ace build. And then just go to the moon. Because I could just say, like, fuck the interest, and I'll just buy what I need when I get it. <laughs> See, it's money later, or I could just get my build now. Like, I'm seeing a way, if I take Scholar and Strength, I could just start winning. And that seems more important to me. Like the whole fucking thing. Uh, okay, Scholar is not actually that good. I don't know. It kind of is. It's more like I want to make Scholar work. 
All right, we're gonna go for <laughs> five of a kind aces and then fuck the bus. I don't know, man. I hate the bus. I'm a big fan of this. I want to try it. We'll see if uh, it fucks me. Oh, I got two kings. Excellent. That was ideal. Perfect. All right, let's dig for other stuff. Oh, hell yeah. All right, great start. We ball. All the stuff. Mmm. Juicy. The hanged man is <laughs> pretty good. Oh, fuck. Lose the jacks. Ah, oh, man. I do admit, though, I am kind of setting myself up to peter out in the middle. But what if I don't? <sighs> okay, this is, like, different from Scala. This isn't the same... It doesn't spark the same joy. It's similar joy, but not the same joy. Dig. There are some aces. All right, what am I more likely to get? Fives. Maybe keep around the three. I could take a three. Got fives. I also have a straight flush, but I don't give a shit. Full house, baby. <laughs> Is this becoming a full house build? Maybe. <laughs> uh, it kind of is. I mean, that's what I was thinking about when I was um, going Odd Todd Scholar. Get a shit ton of aces, that's an automatic full house build. And here we have the full house synergy. Uh, fuck, it's a full house, full house build. All right. Full house ace build. Good times. I'm not gonna buy a pack for that. Now, uh, awkward with the arm. Maybe I should have actually held on to the the planet. Um, yeah, I should have held on to it. I'm probably gonna play like some, like a four of a kind if I can help it. We'll see. Try to be building up the bus. I never really wanted to play the bus. Okay. Never wanted to play the bus. Guess I could just win with a high card ace. And don't overthink it. Yeah, I never wanted to play the bus. To <laughs> shoot the moon is interesting. Spectro is happening. I'm definitely buying strength as well. I could buy strength first. Um, but I'm probably gonna get rid of queens. <laughs> Tempting. Gold sail on an ace, I guess. I don't care about planets, because I'll probably miss anyway. Damn shame I couldn't hit anything better. There was a lot of ace energy here. Or potential. And we sit. Unless I want to... No, I don't need to buy shoot the moon. Don't need this. Negative joker could be okay. Could be. Might suck. Show me the kings. 
There's one. I'm actually going to keep it around. I see if I can hit the other one. Yeah, I'm going to see if I can hit the other one. Even discarding fives. Didn't hit it. Now, I could just play four of a kind. <laughs> I could also just do king and two and then get a full house. I mean, that's fine. Or I could also do it on the jacks to jacks become queens, queens become kings, kings become aces. That's a stretch. I might use strength on queens at some point, though. There's one more king in the deck. Um, but this is good. This is really good. I'm just checking. I'm going to play a full house here. So I guess this is how I would do it. To the damn moon! We climb. Oh, we are balling. Just looking for a times joker now. Plus 12 molt uh, is pretty good. Better than Nova for now. I mean, I might just, I guess I just buy it. Well, you could also not buy it. Plus, blue chips are okay. Uh, just okay. Actually, no. This won't be that good. With Odd Todd, Odd Todd is way better than Blue Joker. I don't need more ch uh, blue chips at all. Especially a Scholar as well. So I'm looking for times red, basically. Zany Joker's really okay now. It's four bucks, and I sell it for two, so I spend two bucks total for a little bit of bridging the gap. Eventually, I probably will sell it, or Supernova. I mean, it's fair to just bridge the gap. Yeah, because I'm really one joker away from winning. The only thing that I'm thinking about is actually, I kind of uh, I kind of want a negative joker, but it might suck. Nah, the odds of the joker being helpful are low. I'm really digging for like a specific like three or four jokers, and the second I get any one of them, I just win. Does that mean I take or just hold on to Zany? I just got 9,000. All face cards are drawn face down. <sighs> I don't face that right away. This is effectively times 1.5, about, and it gets worse with time. So I think that means I pass. But it's a tough one, tough read. Let's just get rid of some of the evens here. I'll keep around the pair of eights, I guess. See if I get anything with that. Uh, useless. Useless. I have more threes than nine, so I guess I keep the three. Okay, got the seal. So I'm going to play ace, jack. I'm just going to play high card here. Do I keep the eights? I guess I can. Yeah, this is fine. Scale bus a little. This gets a lot of stuff. And dig for a full house. Seems good to me. This does not ruin the bus. Because the jack does not score. Okay. Almost have a full house. Although two pair may just win. Shit. Um, it's not a great two pair. I don't know what that gets me. Um, I'd play like this, probably. Huh. Okay, plus 60. Hold on, let's see. 19, 19 is about 60. A little bit less. 120 in red, and then 11, that's 13, 15, and then 23, that's about uh, 2,500, 3,000-ish. So it's not spectacular. I could also play like this, just dig four. 
more odd Todd's energy. Of course, then I miss out on the full house potential. But if I get three of a kind in aces, that's fine. Or if I get two pair with two fives, I think that wins too after this. So this is okay. Basically, any ace five or three is fine. At least it fucking better be. <laughs> uh. It's a lot of odd Todd. Even better supernova, even better bus. Yeah, better be. Yeah, excellent. Okay. Fool is good. We Joker. Um. Ah, isn't actually it. It's not my build. I'm evacuating twos. So I'm a big fan of taking the Fool into strength. And then maybe just sitting? I think that's okay. Yeah, the eternal sticker is tiny. It's a baby. Uh. Yeah, so I like the fool here. Um, just double checking. I need more aces. This will somehow eventually get more me more aces. And then we sit. Okay, so I'm probably gonna use strength on face cards, whatever those end up being. Although, I, sh I should probably wait. Get more aces. Yeah, so I got a two pair, and I got a full house. Excellent. Nice. Yeah, save strength for when I know what I'm getting. The overstock plus. Banger. I guess I could wait until next shop and then pop off. I guess I could buy eggs since it'll probably net me money. Since I actually have the space for it. It's gonna net, well, it's gonna sell for one more dollar than I buy and it's gonna cost me one dollar interest. So worst case scenario is that it does nothing. Um, and I guess I could buy this next shop and then pop off. So we'll see. Flush, don't care. Extra large blind. Okay, that's gonna be a tough one. I'm gonna have to hard dig for the wall. So, looking for kings and aces. I got seven in my deck. Start with this. And we'll see if I hit threes. Hmm. Unfortunately, no. Well, I got a three. Do I ever play the two pair? Tempting. It's very tempting. Mm, I'm actually really tempted to, but... Because otherwise, there's only four cards I want to discard. Kind of like this. Get rid of the six. Technically the eight, but they're all just kind of there. Yeah, play an okay hand now and get five cards out of here. The main thing is getting the five cards gone. Okay, good. I got ace. Now, I could... Is this suddenly a two pair build? 
I mean, two bear in full house, I guess it's nice to have a little bumps. Supernova is kind of ass right now because I'm diversifying. I'm definitely not going high cards, so Supernova is probably going to be the first guy out the door. I think I just need to accept that. Wait, this doesn't win, does it? Oh shit, this might win. Well, if it does, there's nothing I'm digging for, so I guess I just play it. This is a very good hand. The aces are disgusting. Okay, it doesn't win. Very close, though. I got my king. Uh, I'm gonna see if I can hit something else to go along with the king to strength. Oh, I got a queen. That's excellent. Okay. Perfect. More aces. I know there's the full house thing, but I don't give a shit. I just want more aces. I might even play a four of a kind right now. Unless if I want to grow pair? No, regular pair I don't give a shit about. I should know what a four of a kind gets me, because I think I'm going to be playing a lot more of those in the future. What does it get me? Gets me 12,000. Because that's the whole point of the ace build. We go for four of a kinds. Alright, so overstock plus. Oh, I also got a spectral pack. Book. Obviously not pareidolia. Hmm. One of four. This is really good. Even with the increased costs. I have to buy overstock plus. Oh, not right now, technically. But I'm always doing this. I might as well just get it going. It's more expensive. Alright, Cryptid's great on an ace. I do love Aura, um, but I want more aces. That's the whole point of the build. We just spam aces and win. Too bad I didn't hit the gold seal. Um, do I give a shit about what color? Currently, no. What, um... Is there a way to see what bosses I faced in the past of this run? Does anyone know? Have I faced any of the bosses that disable a specific suit? There is not. Okay. Uh, I'll just do Ace of Diamonds then. Wait. I guess there is a, um, a Joker that buffs clubs that I have unlocked, and I don't have the diamonds one, so I guess I'll hit the clubs. So. Overstock Plus can still wait. Hmm, unless... I hate having to wait for it, though. I think I'll live, though, if I go one more round without it. So, we dig. I would keep around the 10s just in case. Okay, uh, what does a five of a kind get me? Do I want to know? Probably want to know. I guess I'm a little curious. Unless if I want to build the four of a kinds, well, I'm, listen, I'm getting rid of Supernova. This is more about diluting the pool. I think I take the five of a kind here. I do want to know as well. 21,000. Alright. Scary stuff, actually. I'm going to have to buy some stuff. So I'm up against 40,000. So I need to replace Supernova. That means I overstock plus, then spend all my money. Oh yeah, Egg can also go. And technically, that can go before Supernova. Okay, we, we got a lot of money, actually. I'm gonna have to spend all of it, though. Because this is kind of a weird choke point. Uh, this is really good. I just discard low cards. This is really good. Um, does that mean I drop Egg? And then drop Supernova next? I think yes. 
But if I'm spending all my money, then keeping egg is good too. Just to like be really good. Obviously, I'm buying this. So I could see myself... Like, let's be honest. I played one four of a kind, one five of a kind. These are the hands I'm about to play. So I guess I'm not really banking on Supernova much. And egg could be like a, um, a way to keep this run going if I spend all my money. Yeah. So this is happening. It's, it's always happening. I'm always probably going to sell both, let's be honest. Death is really good. Oh, I have any baseball card synergy? I do not. I have nothing. Uh, Mystic Summit's really good. I'm going to buy Death for sure. Of course, it's not a times malt. Mystic Summit or something would get replaced eventually. If I reroll, I would have to sell Egg. I don't know what I score now. That's the scary thing. Plus 10 mole. I probably get a lot. So 5 of a kind, plus 5 aces. That's like 170. And then the actual aces, that's like 300, 400-ish, uh, a bit over 400. So this is at least extra 4,000. I think I'm good. Thing is, though, I actually may not even take full advantage of Mystic Summit. I might be able to sit. I think it's safe. A little sketch, but safe. Let's give it a shot. Because I have death, I think that should get me over the hump. So get rid of face cards and low cards. Actually, it doesn't matter whether I get rid of face cards, right? Eh, get rid of low cards. That's the most important thing. Okay, now just discard five. Easy peasy. Okay. So now I'm going to two into ace and then play four aces with a four. Four of a kind's great, but um, there's no world in which I do a straight. Yeah, I got to get rid of the twos now, especially because raised fist exists. I am actually tempted by the straight, though. I genuinely am. But it's probably not good. What would this actually get me? I'm not going to play it. I just want to know. 30 times 4 plus um, 11 plus like 25. So 55, 100, and then, or 95, and then 155. 155 times 4, 155 times 8, 155 times... Uh, 38, 155 times, like, 55-ish, 56, 155 times 56, that's not bad. It's actually pretty good for uh, buying a high time hand, right? Uh, that's 8,600. Okay, not incredible. It's kind of okay, though. I think I might be able to get away with that, then dig for five of kind. Yeah, this is really good for a, a one-off hand. Yeah, I think so. It's, hopefully, it's my worst hand that I play. Oh, 92, even better. I got another straight, <laughs> what the fuck? Um, okay, I don't have an ace this time, and I have fewer odd tods. This is going to be way worse. I'm not drawing my aces. I think I need to draw aces, so I just play this. Oh, there's not nine. I'm dumb. Um, that's not a straight. Well, uh, so I guess I play the shitty high card. I have to play something. There's no way I'm just playing a three of a kind. It's a gay. It's alright. As long as I get a five of a kind to finish it off, it should be fine. I just need to draw the aces. There's aces. Okay, that's pretty big. Okay, so I guess I'm gonna do it. I mean, that's, that's pretty good. Now's the time. 
Yeah, because now, like, I've raised fist maximum power to... Do I want to diversify just in case I get fucked on one suit? Or I could be more likely to get a flush five this way. I don't think this wins wins, or if it does, if it doesn't win, this can be extremely close. What does it get me? Nice, okay. Love it. <laughs> Alright, so that straight first hand play was really nice. Straight second hand play would have been even better. Tarot Tycoon is disgusting. I'm always buying that. Clever Joker is less good than it appears, uh, because I already get a shit ton of blue chips. I probably am gonna buy Hanged Man though, get rid of some low cards. And then, I guess I'll chill. Yeah, I'll buy Tarot Tycoon by the end of this. And I also have Egg for money, um, eventually, so that will be very handy. Of course, Clever Joker could replace Egg, but I'm not dead, right? What, what, um, lines? I'm up against a 25,000 base. It's actually kind of scary. I did do just just do 40k, but I mean, I don't know. I, I think I just got a little bit unlucky with those draws, so I guess it's fine. Face cards are debuffed to get fucked. Uh, does a debuff face card fucked raise fist? It may. I may just play the full house here. It does fuck it. Cool. No, I should probably just gun for a one-hander, if I can help it. Yeah, the odds of me getting a one-hander are great. Just do this. Get out of here. Nope. Not great. Very sad. I wonder what the three of a kind gets me. Maybe that's just... Decent? Maybe it's not? I should be careful. I think I should have just played the full house. Yeah, odds are I should have drawn at least the fourth ace. Fuck. What does the three of a kind get me? Let's see, so 30 times 3, um, times 15, times 45, times uh, 66, and then times 66, 60 times 66, and then 210 times 66. I don't think that gets me there. That is 13,800, so that's a no. Okay, I can dig for a fourth ace. I draw five cards, so... There we go. Four aces should do it. I swear to God if it doesn't. No, it has to do it. I think I have to play this. Hate leaving the jacks in hand, but... I don't know what this gets me. If I miscalculated that, I guess I'm fucked. Um, passable. Uh, I will live. Actually. So I guess I'm not that fucked. I will live.
Right? I better fucking live. Yeah, yeah, for the bus. Uh-huh. I guess the bus do be scaling. Five of Khan's nice. So is Spectral Pack. Uh, don't splash, because then I can't just bail out some face cards. For three, that's fine. Costs a lot of money. Uh, yeah, actually, this is really interesting now. $8 Spectral. How worth it is that? Because that, that's interesting. I, there's so many good. There's, you know, there's the duplicate in Ace. There's, like, get a red seal on an Ace. There's, um, you know, uh, get the enhanced Aces. I think there's a lot of good potential with this. Cryptid. Yes, Cryptid's excellent. Uh, put down the club. That's exactly what I was hoping for. No, that's definitely worth the eight bucks. 100%. So now we dig. More aces. Okay, I got a full house. Is that better? Yeah, I think it's okay. Full house is okay. Sure, I keep a five in hand. I just want to check that, yeah, I think I am drawing fewer aces than expected. Unless if I just want to do like a complete dud hand, play the pair of sevens. Uh, Jack will not score. Uh, this is okay. I, I should get a four of a kind or something here. At least a five of a kind. Oh, that's even four thousand. Okay. Um. Or kind isn't everything, but it's still really good. Yeah, I've only seen four aces out of 13 in nearly the top half of my deck. That is worse than expected. I mean, I think I'll just draw some aces. <laughs> Otherwise, my hand is just complete garbage. I'd have to play three cards. All right. Could play two pair here and probably win. If not, I win with the next hand. Good. No, it does feel like uh, getting a little shafted here. Okay. Well, I got a lot of good stuff. A lot of great stuff. Wow. Um, more death, more strength. My, I guess I can afford a Terra Tycoon. I might have to start spending my money. I mean, I can beat this boss probably with those two taros. Because all I need is one five of a kind and I'm good. I have a king and a queen I can hit. I actually don't even know if I tarot tycoon anymore. With the way things are going, I think I'd rather see jokers. So I'm willing to say no to this. Does that mean... Do I ever sell egg for interest? Egg would get me three more interest. Of course, more tarot means more death, more strength. All I need though is any like times multiplier, like a times two, times three. Cause let's see, I mean, out of everything, egg can go and maybe scholar can go, maybe. I mean, you know, I'd sacrifice it for a times three, that's for sure. A 
I think I sell the egg. I wonder if I just like sell egg and do nothing? Well, I could also save it. The question is, am I buying the Tarot Tycoon? I can get Hermit, I can get Temperance, Death, Strength, um, any buffs for the aces, you know, like, uh, plus four malts, plus 30 chips. Uh, tarot's or not, but I'm already getting a lot of Tarot's too, so Tarot Tycoon might be overkill. There's also Sell Egg and Reroll, or I could just Sell Egg and Sit. Oh, Hanged Man is also really good. Fuck, there's a lot of good Tarot's. But, it's, well, I think I just sit. I'm willing to sit, because selling egg is the same as not selling egg as far as interest goes. Uh, and it's actually technically worse if I hit the gold seal, so I will just carry on and not buy Tarot Tycoon. Okay, so I'm digging for, I guess, kings and other trash. Alright, so, don't have Jack for because of Raised Fist. Otherwise, I guess I can Death to have more Aces of Hearts. That's pretty big. Didn't hit here. I think I'm just gonna keep digging. Like this. Wow! This is absurd, right? I have 13 Aces, and I've drawn through a third of my deck. Consistently, I'm drawing less than expected. Like, you realize how fucked that is, right? At least I can play a decent hand, but good god. <laughs> this has happened every single time. I think, though, I can still win despite this. I can win despite this. It's just really funny. Um, in a bad way. So, let's just play this hand. At least, like, I have bust to compensate. Because that's 9,000. That's significant. Yeah, I think I'm going to turn a jack into an ace. Uh, but what about the three? Will I play four aces and a three? No, I, I need a five of a kind. Okay, well, how though? I'd have to play three cards. This is nearly half my deck. I've drawn three out of 13. If I play high card queen, I lose my bus. Um, I might have to... I don't know. Debuffed Queen and Jack don't affect bus. Is this true? Does this fuck bus? If it doesn't fuck bus, then that's objectively the right play. Um, because I need... I'm due for aces. All I need is one five of kind and I win. You've done it yourself, it won't. Okay. Good God, right? I just need to draw one ace. One ace. I did get one ace. Impressive. Also, I want to go for a flush five. Nah, five of kinds is looking pretty spicy here. Okay, and even if this doesn't get there, like I'll have a four. Well, I probably might not have a four of a kind. Is a five of a kind better than the flush house? Well, with all these ace buffs, or this ace buff, I think yes. What is it? Yeah, yeah, it is better. This is four out of 13 aces with more than half my deck draw drawn. Really impressive. I wonder if I ever use strength on the fives and the sixes. No, I'm saving it. I don't think plus two molt make the difference. If plus two molt makes the difference, I'm kind of fucked. Anyway. I think I just play my five of a kind. I'm just nervous. I'm gonna, dr I'm gonna like whiff. Whatever, play it. What does this get me? Because I, I don't know what this score is for me. It should be very, very, very good. Yes, okay. <laughs> Good God. <laughs>
A four of a kind at least should be automatic at this point. I will definitely take Wasteful. I might even immediately grab it. Just so I don't get fucked. And I can hold on to Egg even further. Yeah, this is huge. I mean, this is... This is... This gets me over the hump. Idol is funny. I have a lot of Ace of the Clubs, but not enough. Uh, I think I always take this right away. Question is... Do I sell the egg for more? I think the answer is yes. Yeah, I'm probably going to replace the egg at this point. And then I'm sure I'll get something in two rerolls. I also want Space Joker. No, I only play one per round. Like, or one five of a kind per round. Glass could be okay. It's probably going to fuck me though. So I'm not really... Well, I mean, yeah, I, listen, the Justice is actually pretty cracked. But I do feel like it's going to fuck me. Just with how it's been going. Okay, awesome. I got this. I might... Eh, I don't think I need to buy Pluto. I might even reroll once right now. Just to see it one more potential shop. I think this is right. I think I can get away with it. Steel is okay. Steel is actually pretty good. Um, let's do more for every five bucks I have. I, I, this is not a money build. Chariot's actually pretty good. Like, it, uh, Steel card does represent, like... Um, how much does it represent? This plus 20. So it represents like 20 molt. Yeah, one steel card is 20 molt. So I guess I do it and then save it for a boss probably. All diamonds are deep off. Awesome. I have no diamonds. Can I use another voucher? I don't know. I have a shit ton of discards. I should hit now. Awesome. I got a king. Let's hit something else, like a queen. Jack's okay. I wonder if I just use it now. I would prefer to hit a queen. I'll dig once more. Didn't hit. Okay. Well, I have the five of a kind. Well, now I'll just see. I, I should win on this hand. Okay. I probably should use another jack. I was hoping to get greedy. Uh, didn't happen. Does that mean I use it now? I think yes. And except that uh, queens and jacks are never going to get there with strength. I think that's okay. I can use defs to get aces. Also, once again, drawn four of my aces out of 14, seeing almost half my deck. <laughs> uh. Amazing. I'm gonna save Chariot. If this doesn't win, my next hand will. Yeah, next hand will. Looking good to me. Um, and Chariot could have gotten there, but uh, I'm saving it for the boss, and I don't hate it because I ride the bus. Just want to see what a high card actually gets me. Oh, do I want to intentionally scale bus now? I don't know. Hmm, I never even thought about that. Okay, I got death. Excellent. I think I'll even reroll once. I think I still prefer having money because of times molt. I'm gonna spend the cheap reroll 
And if I miss, I miss. I Oh, four of a kind is tempting. <laughs> I'm not discarding aces. Uh, I almost wonder if I want Mars as like a backup. No, five of a kind should be a gimme. Yeah, should have been a gimme. But the second hand... There shouldn't be a second hand. Yeah, there shouldn't be a second hand. Also, full house is like nearly as good as a four of a kind anyway. I will just sit. 75k, I should be able to get that. Okay, and there's aces. Dig. Dig. <laughs> I found some aces. <laughs> Finally. Assholes. <laughs> About damn time. <laughs> uh, I actually might Chariot now. Nah, I'll save Chariot for the boss. Let's just start with a basic little sit. Um, Do I want to ever play Flush 5? What's Hey, what's Flush 5 at base? Do people know? I think at this point it's probably better for 5 of a kind. What's the base for Flush 5? One sixty times sixteen, so less. Okay, so then I will play like this. Um, I expect this will not win. No, I know this will not win. But then I should hopefully draw something to hit with death. You know, like a two. Oh, of course I could have kept seal for death. Um, I just got ahead of myself. <laughs> I got too excited. It's okay. Um, so if I'm not flush fiving, what's the, what's the boss disabled? Diamonds, so I'm not making diamonds. Uh, let's see if I can do better than the three. But I'll keep the three, well, I don't know, actually. I think I should just discard now. And then whatever is my lowest, I death then. But three is good to hit. I might not hit anything better. I think I'm okay to keep the three just to always have a good death target. Sometimes I get another one, but that's didn't happen. And we win. And Cherry will be great for the boss. Lots of love. Uh, <laughs> DNA! Uh, that's actually... You know, it's better than nothing right now. <laughs> it's, uh, something. Because it's better than... Yeah, I literally have a slot open. That will get me... How many is it going to get me? So I got one here. Probably four more aces. Like, plus three aces. Plus four aces. Unless if I get something that's worth selling for. And also the gold seal, I guess. Especially if I could uh, do a chariot. Steel aces would be ideal. I think that's actually how I'll play it. <laughs> Another planet X. Sure. Devil? Or Judgment. Probably Devil. Yeah, that's fine. I should definitely beat this boss. I have 16 aces. Um, even if they don't score, they still contribute. And only two of them are diamonds anyway. 
All right, so let's get rid of the trash. Dig. Almost there. One more ace. Thank you. Um, so I'll start. I'll probably make um, this one into steel. Yeah, cause, uh, unless if I want to make more gold. No. Yeah, I'm going to have like dual purpose aces. Chariot isn't even necessary. I just need two uh, five of kinds. Yeah, dual purpose aces. Either I play it or it gets a times 1.5. Of course, I am playing three hands then. Oh man. It's a little greedy. I don't think it's that greedy actually. I have um, 15 cards to dig for five aces. It's missable. Do I win even if I don't hit five? I do wish I had six aces in hand right now. Hmm. So the um, idea of not duping a steel ace would mean like I dupe like the six or something. Ooh, I kind of hate that I have a two in hand. Ah, fuck. So what sucks is I will have to play both of these aces. Because I am not about to discard right now for three cards. I'm about to play five cards in an, uh, five of a kind. Which means that the DNA copies the steel, but both steels are about to be played. That is always happening. Um, because I need to get a second five of kind. This deck loves to fuck me. I can also just not DNA this one time. So I could play five cards, draw something, and then mess around. Maybe some discards then. I think I'm okay with uh, skipping over one DNA. Ah, it does hurt. I don't give a shit about whether DNA gives it back. I'm thinking about putting Cherry on something that isn't going to be played. Wait, does that matter? If I put Cherry on something that is played, does that get me over any humps? Um... I know five of a kind is something like 60,000 plus 20 molt is probably like 70,000? Not to mention, using DNA gets rid of a whole hand. So 70,000 means that, well, it's actually more about just having five more cards to look for aces. What I'm thinking about is I might lose right now. That is the consideration. It is possible to lose at 100,000 because I need two uh, five of kinds. Sure, I could draw it. I probably, I mathematically am pretty likely to. Not guaranteed, pretty likely to. Um, but not guaranteed because this deck likes to fuck me. What I could do is just cherry the six. Uh.
and then take the guaranteed points. How about this? How about I do some math? All right, what the fuck is this hand worth? <laughs> How about that? 260 plus 24. 24, um, 44. Um, 54, 56. Uh, 90 times 90 in red. And then 310. Um, 310. 560 times 90. About. Uh, it's like 50,000 on the dot. That is 50,000. So a steel six, all that does is get me up to about 60,000. And it doesn't increase my chances to win. What does matter is not wasting a hand on DNA and then being more likely to draw five aces. I think this is right then. Um, so I have to play... Well, the thing is, if I play two five of kinds, I win guaranteed. If I don't, then I lose guaranteed. So I guess I want to increase my chances to get two five of kinds. But if I don't DNA now, then I guess I'm never going to do it? What about two steals? Surely... I mean, like... Two steals, might, I might be able to get with a five of a kind, then a four of a kind. It would be two steal sixes, because I need the five of a kind. Yeah, what, what's tough is um the fact that... The very next thing I face will also have a hundred thousand dollar chips or a hundred thousand chips. I sh guess I shouldn't have bought DNA. Do I dare do sunk cost where because I bought DNA I have to use it? If I wasn't going to use it, then I should have never bought it. And this is literally the best time to DNA. <laughs> Maybe I have to just hope I can get about 50% chance to draw another five of kind. And plan for the future. So my two options are play Chariot on the ace, DNA it, then play the next fucking Steel Ace, getting no Steel Ace value with the five of a kind, but setting myself up for the future, or playing Scared and just playing a five of a kind now and then maximizing my chance to get a five of a kind in the future. Why do I feel like whichever decision I make is going to be the wrong one? I feel like whichever way I go, I'm going to get fucked. Okay, how about this? If I don't get any DNA aces. If I don't improve my deck for the next round, how fucked am I? Fairly, right? Quite fucked. 
So I, I guess that means I have to do it. Ah, <laughs> oh, shit. I'm gonna... I, I'm gonna intentionally not go for flush five, because flush five is worse than what I have. I guess I'll dupla a spade. Oh yeah, but all I need is a times multiplier. That's what I'm digging for. That's what I'm digging for. All I need is one times three, and then I'm pretty much guaranteed the win. Or even a times two probably gets me there. Ah. Fuck. So it doesn't even matter if I DNA. Oh god, this all sucks. This all sucks. Fucking hell. I'm definitely not playing four of a kind plus steel. That is... Nightmare. Okay. Alright, time to lose. Let's see what happens. Alright, so I have to play this. This is my only option. I'm never fucking discarding here. I need to maximize the amount of aces I see. Alright, so there's... Two. This is a less good ace. I will still win because I have a buffer uh, if I get five aces. Wow, okay. Lucky me. Oof. Lucky me. So now let's just devil. Devil on like a nine. Um, unfortunately, raise fist doesn't get that much. I think it still wins though. Oh no, though, with the diamonds? It's a little sketch. Do I ever just play the five? Is that... Is that a big deal? Oh, no. Ah, fuck. Because <laughs> um, I'm also... Like, I'm not getting 50,000 because of this ace. But I, I can't be getting that much less. There's no way, right? I lose on 50 chips, 4 malt. Surely not, right? Of course, I could brick even harder. I think I'll just play the hand, and then whatever hand I get next will probably get me over the hump. I'm gonna keep around the nine, or maybe the jack, shouldn't really matter. Let's do the nine. Yeah, I, if this doesn't win, I think the next hand will. Yeah, next hand definitely will. We're chilling. Okay, the greed paid off. Fucking, that was hard. Okay. Oh, okay, huge, huge, okay. Huge, 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 huge. Everything is massive here. This is insane. This is insanely good. All right, plus one hand size is life-changing. Otherwise, I'm digging for a good joker now. Uh, boss blind could be interesting. Dusk is pretty good. <laughs> uh, is it better than DNA good, though? It's not times molt. Yeah, I need times molt. I'm looking for the duo, the trio, the family. Uh, this does not get me enough. Unless if I think it's, like, better than Odd Todd. No, it's only the final hand. It's o The thing is, it's the only final hand. I'm playing two uh, uh, five of kinds. So it doesn't help on the other hand. We dig. Um, Hierophant's good. I think I might just take it. Put on some aces. I think I'll even reroll once more. Just bought the fat. I could also sit. And one more. Didn't hit. All 
Okay, well, now I have more DNA grid. Oh, it's only 90,000? Well, good, thank you. <laughs> okay, if I got 100,000, I could definitely get 90,000. Okay, so now... Uh, probably gonna Hierophant here. Let's start with digging for even more aces. Probably gonna, yeah, put bonus on the steals. Bonus on the steals? Or maybe just bonus on the non-steals? Dual purpose aces? Hmm. Oh, you, you can't bonus a steal. Right, that's different things. <laughs> uh, that's a different thing. Okay, I'm gonna dig for the gold seal, potentially. Okay, whatever. I'm gonna dupe this to begin with. Let the games begin. Just checking, just checking, just checking. Right. Uh, Hierophant's probably just the clubs. Maybe one club, one spade. I guess I'm playing a steel card, but that's fine. I'm not going to discard three cards, that's for sure. Yeah, no, this is fine. I'm never going to discard three cards. So just play the hand. Seventy was pretty good. Seventy nine thousand. Huge. And I wonder if a four of a, well three of a kind definitely hits there. Four of a kind probably also. What was better? I think the four of a kind's better. Yeah, four of a kind should just win, so I shouldn't really overthink this. Full house. Oh yeah, four houses. Um. Probably just as good. What does a full house get me? It is one less ace, but I also get times 1.5 molt. It was a get me. 22,000. That's a good backup hand. More hermit. Strength, Spectral. Spectral's really good. Uh, plus 20 Molt. Is that better than Raised Fist? Sometimes. Strength, I have no more Kings, right? So that's not worth it. I like Spectral. I'm not gonna buy it right away, though. Because I'm gonna maximum dig... Yeah, I wasn't happy with plus 20. Um, maximum dig for, like, the family or something like that. Juggler's okay. Now, Spectral's fine here now. Unless I want to hit a times... Mm. Interesting. Yeah, I mean, Spectral's nuts. Even though there's only two... It's just always objectively good for my deck. Hugely good for my deck. But sometimes it whiffs. Gold seal's fine. Purple seal's also fine. Uh, purple seal I like more than gold seal. It's not amazing, but at least I get some value. Red seal would have been awesome. I'm definitely beating this boss, so I'm not really concerned. Because the Serpent's really nice. Just get a big hand and then pop the hell off. Alright, so I'm probably duping the Ace of Spades again. Okay, got my two. Guess I'll discard first. High Priestess. Anything good here? Ooh, hell yeah! Yeah, boy! That's good. I'll just hold on to that. Doesn't make a difference right now. Uh, I have four aces. How the fuck does this keep happening to me? <laughs> Suck my dick. And the rest of the cards are pretty dog shit, too. Okay, this actually feels like a time to say fuck DNA.
Like, I think I might just play Ace, Queen, Jack, 10, 9. And say, fuck DNA. I think when it comes to that, that is awful. Don't worry, the Queen and Jack don't score. That's what the ace is for. Not a straight. Um, don't need to play Venus. Just draw me some aces, huh? 5,000. Well, those are some aces. I guess I'm just not steel carding. Ew. Is this where I lose? Oh no. I think I have to play the five. Couldn't have even drawn a sixth one. Impressive, really. Like, it feels like I may have to play off again. Uh... Well, let's see, what does the steel cards do for me? I have 27, so 47. First one gets me plus 23. Second one gets me plus like 35-ish. Plus 35 is not bad. Uh, the issue is, if I do this, I'm only playing one five of a kind hand. I can very likely play two five of a kind hands if I do this. Maybe this is just good. If this gets me halfway there, I win. So let me count this. Um, 295. <laughs> uh, I, count again. Classic. 47. Um, 57. 60. Five, 107 in red, 107 in red, and then 350, 600 times 107, 64, 200, that times 2 is 128, 400. I think I win if I play two five of a kind. Um, cause that plus 5181 gets me close enough that I could play any hand to win. So this is the safer play. Yeah, two five of a kind just win, so you take that. Um, this is not times 2.5 total. It is times 2.5 only slightly. Cause now you play, now we have a shit hand. It's not times 2.25. Um... But I have to hope I get there. Odds of me drawing three aces. We'll see. It's a pair. It's not trash. Fuck, it's over. Damn shame too, I would have beaten the boss and I probably would have found a times four. You hate to see it. Man, the whole time we were fighting bad odds. I really thought we could have dug out of that. Is this better? <laughs> uh, this is the best hand I can do. I think this is better this way. It's not going to get there, but you know, we tried. That was some shit, man. So much. Run it back.
Yeah, my deck had a grudge. It was out to get me a little bit. I thought it was a fun build. Can't win them all. Uh, no flushes. Nice. Hand contains a pair. Definitely gonna go paintbrush. That's a gimme, so maybe I just hold? Well, I could go Sly Joker and then just full house win with that. If I get Sly Joker, am I going to be priced out of voucher? I don't think so, right? If I drop down to four, I just need six bucks. So I just need to win in two hands. Just. Not guaranteed. I could also sell this for the paintbrush if needed. I think I'm okay with that. It's fine early. I could also go Hierophant instead. It's technically um, plus 60 chips. Yeah, but this is going to matter twice. This is going to matter twice. Oh, wait, there's a Buffoon pack. Oh, I really want Paintbrush, though. If I paint, or if I Buffoon pack, then I'm going to need to one-shot it. Oh yeah, I guess I can sell if it's bad. Whatever, it's early. Okay, popcorn's nice. Popcorn just wins. And worst case scenario, I can still sell for paintbrush. Alright, so any decent hand. Uh, flush is pretty likely. Nice, I got it. Let's just see if I can get better. It's like the game apologizing for that last run. Alright, perfect. And I, yeah, excellent. Okay! Paintbrush, paintbrush. Minus one hand size, just in time for me to get plus one hand size. Okay, I'm drawing... Eight cards, and get, I get a straight. Any one of those eight. Nice, got it. Also a flush, but I think this is better. Alright, so I've got a bit of a buffer, but I'm looking for anything that's permanent. If popcorn drops down the four molt, I'm surely that will, um... It won't, like, auto-sell, right? <laughs> Temperance is negative money. I could go raised fist into Temperance for a net of one dollar, or I could buy Temperance and hold it. I think that's the play, actually. Raised fist is really good, too, um, for early game. I think I'm always buying this and holding it. It will come in clutch at some point. It does get destroyed. Interesting. Um, raised fist... It is permanent, decent early game. Hmm. Hmm. I, I might do it just for consistency. Slide Joker is okay. I think I can find a better blue chip Joker though. Alright, so let's just get rid of the low ones. Um, I guess I could play a flush. I think I'm more likely to get flush material. Hem. Oh, I have a straight. I guess I just play the straight. Should've just went on the spot. Good. I think raised fist. I don't know if it put it over the hump, but it was certainly even a helpful bump. Okay, definitely not taking eternal money. And we wait. 
kings and nines, or a flush. Flush is more likely to actually happen. Kings and nines may not even pay more um, because of raised fist. So I think I'm going for the flush. Jeez. Okay, let's get rid of the low ones. <laughs> uh, it doesn't get better. Wait a second. I thought I had flush. Did I just cut a heart with uh, on accident? No, I just never drew another heart. Oh. The fuck? I thought I had five hearts in hand. I left a diamond in hand. Des excellently misclick it. I feel like something weird happened. Okay, well, I'm going to play this hand then. And maybe it's just fine. It's not just fine. But I think I'll get out with my life. Alright, so I have to sell popcorn now. <laughs> Golden Joker for money, I guess, but... Buffoon would probably actually do something for me. Okay, this is fine. This is fine. I can do this for money. I can use temperance now. Use popcorn to sell popcorn. Uh, I could have done buffoon pack first. I'm going to always do buffoon pack. I'm always going to sell popcorn. Here's what I'll do. I'll open this. Oh, banana's nice. Okay. Maybe I can find the Cavendish. Uh, this is a net zero. That's a full house. I think it wins thanks to banana. Put the gold card on like an eight or something. Or maybe I'll try to find something better because of raised fist. Let's use my discards. I'm trying to ooh, put the devil on the queen now. I think this is actually fine. I can go aces over kings. Or kings over aces. I think this is okay. If this doesn't win, I'll have another discard in the bag. But I think this wins. Nice. Just barely. Banana's alive. <laughs> His aces again. Dude, that... <sighs> a little bummed about that last run. Grabber could be okay. I'm not committed to any hand. I don't need to get it yet uh, until I've maxed out interest anyway. Yeah, I don't have enough aces to justify Scholar. Hmm. Even Steven could be okay. Like as a backup if the banana breaks. When the banana breaks, let's be real. Mm. I suppose so. Because yeah, at least this hits more cards. And then I'll I'll keep saving up interest. I'll get that grabber by the end of it all. Okay, so I'm digging for evens. Like this. Keep the jacks just in case. I seem to uh, be one off of a flush, I guess. Is that the play? Gross, I guess. Wait, do I have a straight? No, I'm eight cards to a straight. Wait, no, am I eight cards to a straight? There's three queens and four sevens. I'm seven cards to a straight, seven cards to a flush. Um, flush. Actually, might score less than the straight. Hmm. Shh. I guess the straight. Right? Because there's only five less chips than the flush. Straight's better. Um, same amount of cards to hit. Slightly bet higher values. 
which makes up for it, and we'll hope I hit it. If I whiff, uh, that fucking sucks. Didn't whiff. Nice. Um, how many clubs are left? Eight of them. Yeah, this is fine. Unless... Is this straight better? The whole thing's a straight. Hmm. I... So the difference here is plus 10 molt. I lose out on... Uh... 15 chips. I think 10 molt gets me further than 15 chips, and I have better even Steven. So actually, this is a lot of molt. It's, it's like a plus 14 molt. I think it's worth it. Didn't get there, but... Still seem decent. Okay, we play the evens. This gets there. That was also a good hand. Oh, there goes the banana! Good thing I have even Steven. Looking for... It. Ah! Finally! <laughs> uh, I don't know why I said finally. It's just, you know, finally a times molt. I think that's uh, that was where that came from. A time an X3. Well, that was, I guess, lucky. Flash guard could be decent for scaling. Um, scale rerolls. I'm going to be rerolling a lot since I'm not buying packs. So flash guard, I think, actually gets better on this rank. It, I bet it does. And then there's probably a lot that works well with it. I'll try it. Since I have the times three, I can afford to experiment. I'll hold on to the rest of my money. I can play one more. It's the one out of a thousand. Who knows what could happen here? Do I just play this straight? I have a times three, so I probably just win. I think so. Um. Hopefully, I don't know if I win. <laughs> I have no idea if I win. Let's just try it. No, I don't. Okay. Good to know. I'm not even using the discards. It's kind of funny. It's kind of out of uh, laziness more than anything else. A two pair was better than the straight. Okay, keep that in the bank. Um, really should not even be playing non-straights. Uh, so grabber always happens. And then... Maybe I'll reroll? Maybe I won't? Actually, does it always happen? What the fuck kind of run is this? Ah, shit. Do I need... Yeah, I, you know, I probably need my, all my hands. You know, it, the... I... No matter what the build is, even in a five-of-a-kind build, you need all the hands. So, that's fine. Uh, I could rest. Discards two random cards per hand played. All right, can I one-shot this? Look for a full house of evens. So, I'm gonna discard like this, actually. Keep the twos for full house potential. Okay. I could play with queens... Does that get there? Grabber isn't quite literally plus one money per round because of um, the interest. Like this round, it's actually minus one money. But I might actually be able to get more economy now. And also there's the 10 cost up front. Maybe this just wins? Well, uh, maybe, maybe not. It doesn't. Okay. It's ace, ace, jack, jack win. Probably yes. I should probably discard. Cool. Yeah, you don't take grabber for the income. You take it for the fact that plus one hand can actually save your ass. It would have saved my ass last run, last game. Rerolls cost two dollars less. Holy shit. Um. Yeah, so I do that. And maybe a jumbo buffoon. Nah, probably not. I'm. All do I take this now? I lose one dollar of interest. <laughs> 
Uh, I'm actually considering either holding or just re-rolling now. Like... Uh, one dollar of interest. Or just have this. Of course, if I re-roll now, that basically costs me two dollars in the long run. So I guess it's better to re-roll surplus. I'm thinking about whether I'm gonna jumbo buffoon. Like, I could jumbo buffoon now and then re-roll surplus next time. Get rid of, like, one of these two or the money one. I actually like Jumbo Buffoon here. Um, wait though, I won't get that much money next time? Who gives a shit? Well, why would I go Jumbo Buffoon Why I should be scaling rerolls? In fact, it doesn't matter if I spend that much money right now, because I'll be rerolling like crazy anyway, so I'm okay to float money. Yeah, okay. So, let's dig for... Oh, I got a flush. No, nope, no. Nope. I need to play an even Steven full house. But I will keep most of my diamonds. How about that? I don't know. Uh, I don't know if this... I don't know if this is worth it. <laughs> uh, I may have to settle for the flush. I don't have it right now. This is greedy. Even the two pairs, okay. Yeah, that was greedy. I tried to hedge my bets with the diamonds and then whiffed on both. That's actually really funny. Really sad. I'm one off of fucking everything. Okay, I have five hands. You don't lose with five hands. Am I really gunning for the high cards and nothing else? Could play like this. And then find a club. There's five clubs. I'm gonna whiff. Of course, I say that. If I play these, I don't whiff. God, I hate this game sometimes. Um, I'm really digging for another queen. But you know what? I could play like this. Am I gonna greed? I really wanna greed. Ooh, I really wanna greed. Greedy, greedy, greedy. I don't even know if a flush wins. Maybe don't chance it. It's three dollars. I can be okay. I knew I'd whiff. If I play the clubs, I don't whiff. If I don't play the clubs, I do whiff. Do I have a straight? Nope. Once again, the odds of drawing a club are kind of ass. And there's so many almost straights too. Like I got Jack 10, 9, 8. Actually, what are the odds of me drawing something for this? Uh, there's two queens, two sevens, so worse. Worse. Thank you. I don't know if this gets me there though. I don't get much from raised fists, so this could be bad, but I think the next hand will get me there. Thank God. Well, good thing I didn't spend my money. Because now I need something. <laughs> Fucking something. We're going to start re-rolling. Hallucinations, definitely not worth it. What is this deck about? Um, hey, how does a stone card work with raised fist? I assume it gives me fucking nothing. I assume it's really bad. Or is it really good?
zero points. I could uh, gain some chips, lose Raise Fist. Stone cards are good with this deck because I am in need of blue chips, and this is how I get blue chips. Um, but, I mean, I guess it's going to be that kind of deck. And we start re-rolling. Ooh, money, money, money. Um, yeah, I guess I'm... This isn't anything deck right now. I'm not even going to go planets. Eh, I don't like banner. Face cards is worse than even Steven. Each face card has in hand... I don't know, I think Golden Joker is just better here. I think I can hold then and see if I get anything better next time. So, I've got twos and eights. Just look for a full house in that. Although, I'm more likely to get the flush, and I have 10-4. Now, club flush is more likely. Yeah, there's more to draw into here. There's a stone somewhere here, too. And it's a great club flush. Uh, I should just play it. Because I don't think this wins yet. Okay, so ha not having raised fist hurts here. But I did get the stone card, so that's nice. Let's see, what do I play it with? So it's got to be like a two pair. Fives and what? Fours? I can see it. Or just something. Like, I need some evens, but everything here is a non-even. It's very sad. <laughs> it's not better. I wonder if I just dig for evens and hold the stone? Like, all I get here is plus six molt from flashcard, so I think I just let it kind of suck. Yeah, let the hand suck. I'll get stone card on a hand that has higher molt. Okay, whatever. Shit hand. Happens. Okay, I got some fours. But, I'm um, getting closer. I have a ten I can draw into. This is also going to be a shit hand. I'll use one more two pair and I think it's good. I might lose the two. Because there's only one to draw into. There's also only one eight. Yeah, hard dig for tens. Or fours. Yeah, this is okay. I do hate losing the eight and two if I draw it, but there's only one of each, so it's not something I can expect. I drew both. I, I got sixes, though. It works out. <laughs> I was about to be really fucking disappointed. This better be good, by the way. I don't know what the score is. Oh, I lost. Wait, I may not have lost? Hold on. That's a pretty good hand. I think, yeah, it's way better this way. Maximize even Steven. Just double check there's nothing better. This is as good as it gets. Okay, well, let's hope it gets there. It probably won't. It does, thank God. That was a lucky last draw. Uh, Smear Joker seems pretty helpful, actually. So I can always play a flush. So I could just play, like, five flush hands. Maybe I get rid of Golden Joker then? Well, then Marble Joker sucks. Um, but this is... I could play, like, a flush every hand then? Because how many cards do I draw? I draw, like, nine cards, right? So I play five flushes. And then I just go flush, 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 flush. So, right, I draw, if I draw nine cards, I get a guaranteed flush. That's better than high card. Um, and then I can just scale that. Yeah, I hate high card builds. I will do anything but play a high card build. I don't give a shit how good it is.
Death is really good. Well, is it? Is this even that kind of deck? I got Queen of Spades. Um. Or I could just re-roll again. And keep scaling. No, I think this is really good. Uh, I just play five flushes and then win. I probably win after like four, but uh, hmm. I don't know what I'd do with death. Uh. Excuse me. So I guess I reroll. Bloodstone's decent. <laughs> uh, better than decent. Guess I lose Golden Joker then? Of course, having the money helps the engine, but Bloodstone is a... Uh... Well, it, it triggers before even in flashcard. Wait, no, it triggers after even. Oh. Oh. Hmm. Flash would trigger after. Ugh. It's tough. I'd probably still get rid of Golden because I have enough money on my own. Yeah, this is fun. Doesn't really matter how that's organized. And then we just ride. So we hope I get Red Flushes, which is more likely. Okay, so I organized by Suit. Oh, fuck. Are these... Oh, because even though I've smeared Joker, these are separated. Which fucking suit is this? I think they're both clubs. They also might not be. Could be clubs, could be diamonds. This one could be a clubs. Damn it, this is the only way I don't play five flushes. All right, well, this is the real test of the build. I could spend a discard. Let it be fine. Play reds. It's anything but spades. It can't be hearts either because it's to the right of them. And they have to be face cards. I'll just play it safe. Holy fuck. Okay, well, I guess I'm playing a flush here. Yeah, I guess I... I guess I play a flush. What does this get me? 4,000. Nice. Five flushes wins. And uh, it does even better with a bloodstone. And it does even better with even Steven. Disgusting. <laughs> Alright. Good run. Let's see if I can get more reds now. Of course, there's some bosses that completely fuck me. Space Joker. Sounds pretty good if I'm playing a shit ton of flushes. So I guess screw flash card. <laughs> or maybe screw Steven. Well, no, Steven does great with Bloodstone. Steven is disgusting with Bloodstone. Um, and also, leveling up is disgusting with Bloodstone. Okay, so I guess fuck flash card then. Yeah, I play all flushes all the time. Yeah, every hand is a flush. It is impossible to not play a flush. And then I guess I can just sit, maybe save up for seed money. And I just gotta make sure I order my cards correctly. Yeah, save up for seed money synergy. Empress, I guess, could be solid. Maybe I should have taken it. I didn't. So I'm gonna still discard for reds. Okay. So I have to play like this and then go. So I'm gonna play a lot of flushes. Hopefully I get to level it up. We'll see. The more the better. Okay, I didn't... I got a lot of 
these. Oops, I don't need to really reorder this. I'll just play the high cards. A flush is a flush. What is a non-red flushing? It's probably bad, but it's more like, um, I guess I want to know. Three thousand. All right, so red flushes are where it's at. All right, well, that's a pretty fucking good hand. Um, bam, bam, bam. And then get you two up here. All right. We're chilling. Woof. Wow. Uh, I hit a lot for Bloodstone, but not for Space Joker. <laughs> uh, so I'm looking for oops all sixes, huh? Hey, it's flush. That's pretty good. Mime doesn't actually do anything. Seed money. I'm just saving up for seed money. Okay. Okay, another one of these. I only got one that, but that's fine. And then, come on, Space Joker. You can do it. No. Did not hit much on Bloodstone. Looks like this is going to be a pretty trash flush hand here. Also want to discard. I don't know. I feel like I should just be playing more hands for Space Joker. I'll figure it out. Um, I'll figure out the flow eventually. Right now, I'm just vibing. Bam, 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 bam. Yeah, this is kind of all RNG. It's vibe whiffed on everything. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, God. It's all RNG all the time. Okay, cool. Awesome. Very cool of you. Thanks. Gee, wow. You piece of shit. Oh, very sad. Got a couple bloodstones this time. So, next one wins. Oh, it's the stone card. Uh, I do gotta get red, huh? So we play like that. And dig for red. Okay, I don't think I got there. Unless, if Space Joker wants that, you come and clutch for once. No, we're good. Okay, cool. Man, it's just never gonna happen, is it? It'd be fucking nice. The fish. Fish. Well, I was always in the seed money, but after that, fucking abomination. I may need to play desperate. I shouldn't have to. I feel like I should be getting fucked less than I am now. I was just hoping to get something here. I know seed money and all that, but this isn't doing it for me. Maybe I won't get fucked. Strength was okay, um, but I didn't. So, we ball. Drawn face down after each hand plays. Watching you play makes me realize how good my luck is. <laughs> uh, good times, good times. Right, so I'm gonna need some bloodstones here and maybe a space joker. Wow, it happened. There is hope yet.
Okay, so this is black. This is black. This is probably black? Yeah, who gives a shit though? I oh, I'm discarding. That's that's why. Um, these two are black. This one's probably black. These three are always red. Wait, actually, what? Oh, cards drawn face down. Yeah, these three are always red. This could be red, might not. These both could be red. I don't know. But odds are I draw more reds. Okay. Um, this still could... Uh, I think this actually has to be a heart then. Well, it doesn't matter. I can play this for sure. Just put these here, just in case. Guaranteed flush. Hit the two. I hate Bloodstone. <laughs> uh, I fucking hate Bloodstone. That's fine. Alright. Definitely put too much faith into these assholes. It is what it is. Play a black flush and hope it works out. That's a 10. Not a, not even a flush. <laughs> uh. Good times. Oh, we got a straight. Wowee. Alright, get me out of here. <laughs> uh, what a meme run. Alright, anything but high cards. Let's see if I can make anything but high cards work. Uh, this is ugly. Am I gonna dig for a three? No, because I won't even win. I have nothing going right now. Ew. Ew. Well, hope I hit a 10. Well, there's the flush. Heart flush is more likely. Uh, I would need at least the five, which is... Okay, wait. Uh, no two, no four. I have five cards to draw four for the flush. Versus four for the straight, so. See if I hit it. I did, yay. Was that my math wrong? Well, I guess I was fucked no matter what. Cool. Penis. Double the money. I mean, I guess. Or I could hold and take Faceless Joke. Oh, no, I can't afford both. I do want Faceless Joker very badly. Yeah, I want Faceless Joker more than I want to trigger Hermit, so I'll just use it. Wait, if I use it now, this does nothing, huh? <laughs> uh, because all it does is get me one, uh, Joker trigger. That's very funny. Too bad I can't buy and hold it. But yeah, Faceless Joker is really good. Uh, early game. I'll just hope it works out. But yeah, I, I wanted to buy this because this is probably a better short-term profit. Um, how, <laughs> three pair. Lovely. Cool hand. I may actually just play like nines and threes. Since I'm winning with two hands anyway, might as well. Or it might take three hands. 
Hmm. Right, I do like this slightly less. Yeah, let's go for diamonds. There's a lot of diamonds in there. Oh, do I do it again? Can I get away with it again is the question. I would lose a diamond. If it works, it works. And if I lose, I've wasted no time. So I might as well try. Wow, uh, that's not how I expected to be rewarded. Uh, that is better than the flush by points as well. And I still have a chance to draw even more diamonds. Oh, it doesn't really matter whether I draw diamonds out. Ooh, one more discard would have been spicy. Alright, so lots of money early. Thank you, Faceless. Tens and fours could be good. Just something for early game. Or I think I'd rather go Jumba Buffoon. This is a better chance. Doing something for me. Hey, the Hermit! <laughs> Mattered! Um... Showman's kind of funny. Fibonacci is good for early. Uh, you can't reliably do showman. What? I'm gonna get a second faceless Joker. Woo! I need the first copy of something first. Uh, Fibonacci is great. Red card is slow. No, I'm definitely not doing red card. That gets worse here. Uh, I'm a big fan of Fibonacci. And then Walkie Talkie does not have Fibonacci uh, synergy. Director's cut. I don't think I can afford to do it. I'm too broke. I gotta hold out and just hope that I don't get fucked by boss blinds. Okay, so... Um, I guess I'm gonna play a straight with the 8 for Fibonacci. I guess that just wins? So I shouldn't really worry about it? Oh, there was the greed. I kind of forgot I'd face this Joker. <laughs> this would have been nice a couple runs ago. <laughs> oh, that would have really been nice. Okay, so I'm going to duplicate this shit out of eights. I may even go ride the bus. Huh. Okay, put down an ace. Duplicate aces. What boss I'm up against? I don't know. Alright, well this is a great start. Bus is quite fine. Especially early. I mean, bus was certainly good. Everything is very expensive. And also, I Faceless Joker, right? So, and I Fibonacci, which they all have synergy. I think I can afford to spend the money, as long as I actually remember to fucking discard my stuff. That's the main thing. Um, okay, I think I'm gonna just play like this. Wait, this doesn't win, right? I missed it on Trio, but that's kind of by design. Uh, I'm digging for faces to discard. I think this is safe. Yes, good. Excellent. Big, big, big. And I'll keep around. I guess there's more threes than fives. Ooh, okay, hold on. Hold on. Ace, eight. Um, ace, ace, eight, eight wins. So I want to see if I can greed. I think I can, I would have to play like ace 10 3 or like 10 8 3 and just hope I hit something. Yeah, I mean, it's worth it, right? Even if I hit once, that makes up for all the money lost. And it feeds the bus. I guess that's just preferable, huh? And two aces should just win on the spot, so I think I'll even discard five in hopes to get three more face cards because yet. Wait, no, I have no more discards. Okay. This is fine then. Just win.
That's a good ace. If I could get that ace duped, uh, that's baller. What am I going to destroy? Probably like fours, because I actually want face cards to discard. Jumbo Arcana is tempting. I make a lot of money from faceless. I actually like Jumbo Arcana. Um, before face a hanged man, just in case I get a money one. I think this is worth it, actually. There's a lot of good ones here. Uh, death. Okay, I could lose a six, gain an eight. I also want a chariot. Um, chariot's good with Fibonacci. Less good with Ride the Bus. I like death the most. Too bad I didn't hit eight. any ace. So, I think I'm losing a six because I value my face cards. I'm not... I better not accidentally play them. Um, too bad I couldn't grab a four. That would have been perfect. Do I care about suits? I don't know. But, I mean, eights are fine. It's no ace. It's no red seal ace. That would have been ideal. I'm just double checking. Okay. I love it. I also love Hanged Man, so we can rest. There's a lot that can be gone, like um, six and seven. Oh, I got three of these. Let's start. I actually may begin by Hanged Manning a six and seven. Yeah, cycle through the majority of my deck. And I'll discard everything but the eight. This is fun. Maximum card draw. I got another three. Love to see it. I got eight and five. All right, maximum money. So now... I... want to get to... ride the bus... I have two tens, two threes. I'm probably not going to draw the ace. I'm okay with not activating the trio because I think I just win regardless. Like with just playing two pairs and don't worry, the king doesn't score, red bus doesn't trigger. Um, also, I want to get greedy and like dig for a big one. I don't think it should matter. Okay, it wasn't too much. Uh, all I got is a pair of eights. Which is also really good. Digging, digging. I have the most fives out of all those. I think that wins, though. It doesn't, which is at least good for Ride the Bus. Okay. I wonder what's better, a single ace or two fives? Probably the single ace, yeah? Let's find out. Well, it's not an easy way to compare. But, scaled the bus, got a lot of money. <laughs> Hack! Uh, that's pretty good with Fibonacci, huh? Cool. <laughs> So I guess I actually want a red seal on a two and not an ace or like a five. Well, I could always, <laughs> I could always strength the ace if I feel like it. Um, which is very tempting. Sure, one hand. Okay, don't accidentally lose. Just find a good hand and play it. I have a straight. Is that good? Wait, I don't have a straight. No, I'm missing a seven. Uh, that's not how straights work. I have not much. So. Do I keep the ace? Do I lose, maybe lose six? 
Yo. Ten dollars from Dragon. What are the posters in the background? Uh, that one's the Pillars of Creation, and that one, I don't remember its name. I just found it on Etsy somewhere. Looks cool though. It's like a the woods at night, mystical stuff. So, I guess this is, I could keep the eight, maybe keep the five as well. Hope to hit something good. Eight, eight, 10, 10 was fine. If I get an eight or 10, I win. If I don't, I prob, I don't know if I win. Am I in danger? One, ten, three eights. Four cards. Yeah, but like, what else could I get, right? A uh, pair of fives or threes? Or aces? Like, I could ditch nine, ten, ten. And actually, a uh, two pair isn't even much better than a pair. It's only a few more chips, which is valuable, but I'd rather have like eight, eight, five, five, or eight, eight, three, three. So I discard three cards, looking for three, six, nine, twelve cards. There's twelve good draws. Uh, I don't know if this wins. Maybe this. Let me count this. Does this win? Do I have to worry? Uh, this gets me. 40, uh, 60 minus four is 56 times nine times, why can't it, plus 16, that's gotta be 35, uh, 56 times 35, I might just win. It does, okay, there's nothing to worry about. Two pair wins. Wrong molt. Oh shit. I did 35 instead of 25. Well, I don't know if it wins anymore. Cool. Time to find out. <laughs> Alright, it wins. <laughs> uh, cool. 1400 flat. Tarot Tycoon, maybe. Uh, pretty good for getting stuff down to two threes and fives. I might just buy it. And then never think about it again. Faceless Joker probably gets me back to the next hump. And I basically just get a ton of these assholes. Do I want an Arcana pack? Probably not yet. Eventually I will, but not right now. Let's take a little bit more money first. Ooh, a bunch of face cards. And I got some eights hanging around. Um, I might just lose the two, draw more eights, and hope that I can maybe get uh, two more face cards. I got three eights. Um, does that win? That definitely wins. Uh, I'm gonna play a shit hand then. And I'm gonna dig for two more face cards. Three eights wins on the spot. Pretty much guaranteed. So let's just see what happens. Four eights definitely wins on the spot. <laughs> uh. Come on. One more face card. <laughs> uh, can it happen? Yes! Get out of here. Goodbye. Worth it. Um, here, I'll actually take the money this time. Right, how good is it? 13,000. Great start. <laughs> um, 
Uh, I could theoretically buffoon to do better than Faceless Joker at some point. I actually kind of want to wheel. It's gonna whiff, but you know. I'm streaming. Is buffoon or reroll? Reroll's tempting because I could get some sort of tarot that's helpful. Uh, buffoon. Unless if I hate Ride the Bus. Well, I mean, it's not that I hate Ride the Bus. There's just exists better stuff than Ride the Bus, technically. Standard packs to add... Oh, interesting. I could get like a 2 or 3 or 5 with a red seal or something like that. I don't hate it for 8. All whiffs. I guess I'll take the king because I could strength it. <laughs> That's the main thing. I mean... This is okay, too, actually. That's actually really good with hack. Hold on. Even though it's not a 235, it is a times 2.25, especially since Fib triggers before steel cards. All right, happy did that. Base chips and molt are halved. That's a lot of eights. Duh, okay. Uh, I could just win right now. I don't want to do that. I want to get one more face card. Oh, is each played at 2, 3, 4, or 5? Well, at least it's got the 1.5 times for Fib. Alright, look for another face card. Gotcha. I almost pressed play hand. Oh, God. Alright, I'm not getting any better. Let's play some aces and eights. How's that do for me? That is 19,000, something like that. It's you again. Uh, I do want Arcanas now, actually. And I will wait. Yeah, I'll take... I think I might take both packs, actually. Emperor's good. Uh, the rest are not. Unless I want to, you know, Magician a, a two. Anything good here? Hangman's great. Ooh, okay. The Fool probably for another Emperor? Yeah, I can lose two fours. That's awesome. Unless I want a second hanged man. Ah, uh, that's really tempting. Really good options. Oh, yeah, I could lose the 10 7 and 4 4. Oh, that's also fantastic. Fours can become fives. I mean. Yeah, but like, aces can become twos, and sevens can become eights, fours becoming fives. Oh, yeah, those are also good, though. I think I can live without these fours. Why not remove faces? Uh, I have faceless joker, although eventually I will remove faces. Let's do this. Plus, also, if I can get that guy that um, gets more molt for the less cards I have in my deck, that sounds pretty cool. We're going to Magician, it looks like. And I will take another shot at this. Magician, Glass, Stone. Stone is okay. I don't have any blue chips. Magician, though, on a three... I like that more. I, you know, Magician's fun. Glass is interesting, but, uh... But it'll probably fuck me. Uh, but Justice is really good. It, it is kind of nuts. It's just... Uh, I know I'm gonna get fucked. Because the thing is, I put this glass on a three. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Because, like... I could dupe it and then at least have multiple with the safety net. Like, class through with hack fib. Oh, man. Uh, I could do this and then just sit on it, and eventually I'll be able to dupe it. Like, I'm thinking points here, and this is probably how it, you get the points. 
Just don't play it until I have more of them. Right, give me Empress. Yeah, fuck it. Oh, holy shit! Best possible outcome! Wow. Okay. For once, the uh, Wheel of Fortune knows what's good. Holy fuck. Well, I'm playing a shit hand here. I might play everything but the two and keep the kings. Let the hand be trash. Let the hand be trash. Um. Yeah, hack is better because of fib than eight. So I guess I, I do this. <laughs> okay, nice. It counts for something. I think at this point now I dig for something good. I doubt I'll get a second faceless joker payoff. Well, but I win with one good hand. I guess fives were also good. Well, now they're less good, so... Whoops. Alright, dig for a better hand with that. Okay, I'm gonna play a straight here. I'm gonna take these three and five, make them molt cards. Those are good, yeah. Ace, two, three, four, five. Yeah, looks good to me. <laughs> Even with the polychrome, just jumping it. One hand and oh, temperance is wonderful. Celestial, I don't know. Like I actually don't know. What kind of run is this? I'm playing whatever. Looks like it's high card mostly. Oh, and I got the lucky card. Well, holy shit. Probably gonna buy both packs then, huh? I will actually wait on Temperance until after Spectral. In case I get, like, uh, negative on a Joker. Yeah, I'll just buy this so I have it. Um, Purple Seal's good. Five random cards in hand. As long as it doesn't hit the two, I'm pretty happy. Although... Yeah, even if it does hit the two, I would lose four other cards. Uh, Purple Seal's not bad. Hmm. And it's not like this is a, you know, my crazy glass one or a molt one. This could do nothing for the rest of the game. And the rest are just great hits. Oh well, I hit it. That's fine. I will hopefully just replace it. These all suck. I think I'll just skip here. Yeah, I should probably use this. Yeah, these are all trash. Like, even the blue seal is not worth it. I'm not giving a damn about planets. That is a skip. Uh, I don't care about celestial packs. We just look for goods. <laughs> More money? I'm actually tempted to buy justice. I'm thinking about whether I'm going to use it. I'll just buy it and save it for in-game. Justice, I think, would be really good. Um, just for a card that will be good later. Never mind, I, I am using Temperance. Which vouchers do I have? Okay. Lots of tarot's. Earn interest. Uh, I think I'm fine on money. <laughs> I seem to be okay. Death is excellent. Maybe I just level up high card and two pair? Uh, two pair is pretty good, I think. I've played a shit ton of two pairs, so I'm going to level up both of these. These are the two um, ones I play. I could probably find a replacement for Faceless. Maybe. <laughs> Holy shit. Yeah, with this kind of money, uh, it's just I keep getting um, 
Taros. I might hold now. I could also get a um, money-related Joker, which would help. Yeah, so this is like a... Uh, I think like I actually... I'm going to save. I um, also want to just buy Telescope. Because actually, now that I think about it, because I like two pairs and high cards... Oh, wait, shit. Uh, the trio. <laughs> uh, I don't like two pairs and high cards. I've just settled for them. Well, now when I settle for them, it sucks less. Um, okay, so Telescope actually sucks. All right, one more reroll. I don't want to lose all my discards unless if I get rid of Faceless Joker. Then it makes Ride the Bus terrifying. No, I need my discards. We chill. All right, 10k is pretty easy. Look for the glass. So I could play two pair here. Um, I'm gonna look for a better death target. This doesn't win, right? Better not. It might. Ah, oh, shit, it might. Then I'll just be sitting with Emperor and Death here. <sighs> Fuck. If this wins, I actually... I'm gonna be pretty upset. Hold on. <laughs> ah, fuck. Is there a better death target? Yeah, I got a shit ton of them. I got a glass three. I don't know. Maybe, maybe just the molt three is a good one. Well, I was thinking I just get a shit ton of glass. Or the Molt 5. I guess that's technically better, huh? Look for the Red Seal on the Ace. Yeah, I could dupe that as well. I need to strength that Ace ASAP. Yeah, this seems like it's it's probably going to win. So I'm going to have 5-5-3-3. Um, five, five, three, three. That's going to get me 8 32 72 and then oh, so much vault. 72 in blue. I don't know, it's gonna go to the fucking moon. Um. Oh my god. It's so much I can't even do the math for it. I think the smart play is to abandon Faceless Joker, which means get rid of face cards. And eventually, Ride the Bus will probably go, assuming I find something better. I could just simply never find anything better. And you know what? I'll get more deaths in the future anyway, with this kind of money. You know, I might as well use the death now so I can access it later. Um, okay, not helpful. Yeah, I don't give a shit about hearts. High Priest this. Whatever, we'll see what it is. Four of a kind might get use at some point. Two pair. Maybe I'll just hold it. Alright, now I can spend my discards. Oh, all well, the planets, okay. Cool. What's a full house get me? It's probably disgusting, yeah? This is like super disgusting. Actually, I guess the steel could have been a good dupe. Fuck. <laughs> oh boy. Wowie. Do I have any uncommons? Yeah, I do. Uh, baseball Joker is better than Faceless, that's for sure. Um, now nah, I'm probably just taking standard packs. Uh, yeah, I don't need money anymore. I'm just a little hesitant. Eventually, uh, Ride the Bus can become an uncommon of some sorts. What about... 
Um, standards. Yeah, I mean, I could get some nice twos if I'm lucky. Or threes or something valuable. Nine could be okay with purple seal. I actually like purple seal. Um, too bad I didn't hit otherwise. Uh, this is what the crazy money can do. That's a three. Ace is okay, but three re-triggers hack. So I guess three is fine. Plus it makes me more likely to get three of a kinds. I mean, really I'm playing full houses, four of a kinds, that sort of stuff. I'll reroll a little bit. The Emperor is great. Bloodstone can do stuff sometimes. Full house is great. I'm going to use this actually and sell Uranus. Let's buy the Emperor. I will not use it yet. I actually do like full house because I do play full houses from time to time. It's like full houses and four of a kinds. I could see a Hierophant go. Card sharp, huh? Shit. I'm not married to a hand still. It is uncommon, though. Is it better than bus? Probably yes. Probably a lot better than bus. Assuming that I can get, um... Which hand am I gonna run for, then? Full house? Full house makes sense. And then I don't give a shit if I play, um, face card. But still, I'm gonna try to make everything into hack range. The only downside is, uh... I would need two full houses. Why can't I just win with one full house? I, I would more buy this because of the uh, times 1.5. Like, I think the one times 1.5 alone is better than the bus. <laughs> and it's extra good if uh, I get other value from it. So I guess I take it. Unless if I have a bad fib time, but... It's more like, uh, in, yeah, then I could see, like, if I play two pair twice, is this good? That sort of thing, right? Um, I'm also gonna buy this. I guess I'm gonna buy these two and then sit. Yeah, because at least, like, this can bail me out if I have to hide hard twice. Or, like, pair twice. I think it's a fun. So I have this, put it like here or something. Get this, and I'll sit. Okay, so now I dig for low cards. <laughs> uh, there is a two pair here. But I don't give a shit. Okay, got fives. I also got eights. So that's really good. Um, I'll put the f a Hierophant on fives. I guess I should just do that now. That's always going to happen. And then I'll see what I get with Emperor. Hanged Man is excellent. Uh, nothing to actually hit it with. The Sun, I don't care. Let me check. Yeah, I, I don't give a shit about the Sun. Uh, so I'll keep the eights and fives, dig for the rest to see what I get. Because uh, I think that already wins, but ideally I want... I didn't get it. Uh, I'll hit with Hangman next time, I guess. whoop de doo It'll hit, eventually. I'm gonna keep that purple seal on my deck, that's for sure. Alright, what do I get here? Yeah, it's already winning. <laughs> that is like anti-eight winning. Oh, uh, fuck. Uh, Hermit's disgusting. Hierophant's good. So is Empress. Uh, I can't actually fit all those in, though. So I guess between the two, I prefer Hierophant, actually. Because I do actually need chips. Hierophant, I think, is the better option. Um, what am I looking for? <laughs> uh, maybe there's something cool in here. I guess. Nah. Uncommon for chips. Is that better than card sharp? Technically, I guess. Because I'm not duping my hands. <laughs> Somewhat scaling. I think, like, I, I think it's better. But is there any world? I don't know. Because, yeah, I'm also always playing the same cards. I'm always playing twos, threes, fives, and eights. 
Hiker tr triggers twice with hack. Does it really? Oh, that, okay. I'm sold. Is They're both uncommon. Let's give this a shot. This seems pretty good. This is consistency, I think. I think if I do this, I can get enough blue chips to be able to win in one hand consistently. Um, so, I guess I'm re-rolling. I don't know what I'm looking for. Is a steel's pretty good. Um, but is it better than bonus? I actually really like both bonus and hanged man. Listen, steel's good. Tarot is in general are fucking amazing. I wonder if I ever buy telescope to get it out of my swamp. I'm almost at full house, right? I'm playing a lot of full houses. Maybe I just buy it. And maybe eventually it'll be useful. Down the line, I'd be happy to pay like 10 bucks for a full house um, thingy. If this, you know, if this was like one or two, I wouldn't do it. But I think I can get there. And one more reroll. <laughs> okay, it's the funny one. Nope. Alright, let's play. One dollar per card played. Okay, so I'm getting rid of some shit here. Uh, but I didn't draw it. So I have... Oh, no, I can lose queen nine. What am I talking about? It's the other nine I don't like. Or the other nine that I do like. This is good. So I'll lose this. I could keep the aces. And what about the fives? Fives are my good cards. Aces, I could discard. Yeah, look for something better. Be a little greedy. It is very greedy though. I don't know if it is. I think this is fine. I think, um, I also want to keep the two and three. Maybe I could keep the three. Two, I don't think I'm playing. Like, I'd rather play threes and fives if I can help it. I have more of them, and they're worth more. And also, let's get these out of here. Death! Oh, fuck. Um, well, this is obvious. I wonder... No, I can save death for later. Yeah, because I... Oh, Jesus! <laughs> oh, man! Uh, king and the five, it looks like. Uh, I think I will hit the chips one. I like... Th oh, but there's also all the times mults. Wow, actually. What, how, how many multipliers do I have? So I got three times 1.5s. Uh, four times 1.5s. And a times three. Uh, what does that actually come out to? 1.5 to the fourth is five. That times three is times 15. So... What I like to do is do 15 times 4 versus 30. So 60 is more than 30, therefore I would want more of the molts. So we will do that. And then bam, bam, bam. Wait, let's do Hierophant. And Hiker gives me a lot of chips anyway. Oh, that's another good reason. But yeah, full houses, banger hand. I'm okay with losing five bucks. I probably... No, I wanted to play a full house so I can be more likely to telescope with it. Okay, we're already there. <laughs> that is one shot the final boss kind of chips. And only scaling. I don't need more planet cards in my shop. I will take a Arcana pack. It's a chance to get me something good. Um, Strength is... Normally great, not helpful here. Damn. I mean, unless I want to go, like, king and queen on strength. Uh, that is... I mean, I could always go justice. Well, I'm liking the uh, glass less now. I th yeah, all these kind of stink. Strength is the only one that can kind of help. Uh, if I find fool in shop, that would be very nice. Because I would love to have a strength in hand to be able to hit that red sh sealed ace. And let's let it ride. But that being said, I guess I'm just chilling. That's fine. 25,000. I guess actually I could have considered skipping for a free shop. That gets significantly better. I'm going to get rid of the two here. 
Justice. More glass cards. Alright, so I already got three fives. That probably just wins on the spot. I'll still dig, try to find that full house. I don't think I need to glass the ace yet. I don't know what I'm going to do with Justice. I mean, I could just do it and then hold on to it. I guess I don't hate it here. Yeah, I can't think of anything else I actually genuinely want to do with it. This could, like, be the ace in the hole, literally. It will be clutch one day, but not today. Um, so I want all the extra chips on my fives. Do I stack particular threes or do I spread it out? Well, I always play this guy. I could spread the love. I think I... Mm. I like spreading the love here just because I only need a little bit more consistency. Because the numbers are already there. This is a gross build. <laughs> Bro! <laughs> oh, man. Oh, that's unfair. That is so unfair. I think I'll probably take some more Taros. Do I need it this badly? Man, packs are expensive. I can get one pack, but maybe it's good. Maybe I get a money joker or money tarot. I got the fool. Oh, I got a money joker. Okay, I could do two money jokers. I could also do strength on an ace. I'm definitely doing temperance. I might just double temperance here. Um, because strength on an ace, twos aren't that good, and it's not even the ace I wanted to hit anyway, so this seems really good. And then I can get the other pack as well. Big money. Higher fans good. Um, now I got this guy. Alright, well, Hierophant's great here. Can't complain. I also want an Empress. Well, Empress can be used later. I might as well use Hierophant now if I really have to. I can replace Hierophant with Empress. Just checking. Yeah, I might as well get my value here. The Fool again. I think I'll just buy and hold this. Eh, you never know, sometimes it hits. <laughs> okay, plus 10 malt. This guy should go in the beginning now. Wow. This run is really lucky. <laughs> uh, the luck seems to go like this today. It is not a straight path. It is a sine wave. It is a roller coaster. So, anyway. <laughs> Do I want more Wheel of Fortunes? No, I'm saving this for, like, um, Hanged Man death. That's it. Got my fives. Also got twos. Might as well keep the pair. I could Empress some twos if I wanted to, and I do want to. Yeah, this is fine. I guess I can play twos. Seems easy enough. More. 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 <laughs> oh boy, 480. Love it. Um, okay, maybe standard pack, see if I hit. What am I looking for? Don't I already- well, looking for fives and threes. Basically, fives and threes. More fives and threes in any way. Uh, Queen of Steel is actually really good. The eight- I mean, I do like eights, but I also do like- st Well, mmm, I may skip. It's either a steal or skip. Because, um, I think the play is just increased consistency. I was here looking for a five and three because that was the consistency. Eight is a decent backup, but twos are a better backup. So I'm going to skip and try again. Five or three. Total whiff. There is nothing here. 
worth a shot. All face cards are debuffed. Well, I was not playing any of those in the first place. There are some threes. I am not gonna play the nines. Ooh, got that. Um, do I just keep the full house? And let the three of glass go off? I think that's okay. Although I'd prefer not to play the aces. I prefer to play fives. Maybe just dig for a five. I could see it. How am I, uh, okay. Full house is my most played hand right now. I'm kind of looking for a chance to not use this three of hearts. If I can help it. Just so it stays alive for later time. So I'm actually, I'm going to play like this. I think I can afford to play like this. Um, okay, awesome. I found a way to do it. Let's, I'll just hold on to that. I'll hit you. No, spread the love, spread the love. So these three, these two, perfect. Very good, but that's 654. All right. Steel's good, bonus is good. Um, I could put steel on like a five or three. I could also put it on that red seal. There's glass on there. I think I kind of want director's cut. I feel like that's a good consistency one. So, fuck the world. Buy chariot. So, I do get a uh, full house with this. So, I guess I upgrade it? And then, like, also hit just some sort of backup one? And I can get director's cut later? I think that's fine. $13 for a full house. I mean, it's something. What is it, though? Realistically, the main thing it does is give me extra blue chips by 25. Do I need extra blue chips by 25? Maybe not. I'm gonna buy Director's Cut. Decrease level of played poker hand. Moderately annoying. <laughs> Four of a kind. So. Um. A little awkward here. I think I'll just discard these. Try to hit. Got threes. Got fives. I think I'd prefer to play five. I can greet it like this. Even if I get two pair, I think I'm okay. I got four of a kind. Interesting. See, I wonder if I ever put chariots on a three. So I could just play a three of a kind. Or, you know, have it be like a dual purpose. Three. Or the eight, actually. The eight might be a better one, because eights are like a backup. Eights are a backup, and that makes for a pretty good chariot. Yeah, I like the eight a lot, and the fool, eh, he'll do something eventually. Uh, do I play a four of a kind? Probably, yeah. Play all the threes. And this is when scored. I don't even know what a four of a kind gets me. Time to find out. Don't get to play the five, but that's okay. Threes are still good, because threes are plentiful. <laughs> One million! Oh, nice! I got a full house. Thanks. I guess I don't hate using the uh, Mars either. And I think that's perfectly okay. Take a stab at the standard, see if I hit it. This is begging to become steeled. It's my backup, yes, but I have 
Oh, only four eights. That's a close one. That That's really close. Because uh, it does decrease consistency. That's hmm, really interesting. It has a red seal, which is the toughest thing. But uh, yeah, if I get one steel card, this will be the priority target. Target, And eights, again, are my backup, so that just further validates that. I don't need a Mega Buffoon. I guess I'm just decreasing the level of a played Poker Hand. It happens. Oh, well. Okay. Got some eights. Eights are a good backup. Two fours. I'm not going to play that. See if I can hit another three. Okay, so I didn't. Now this is interesting. Why do I want to play an ace? <laughs> there is a straight with two glass cards. I guess I don't hate if either of these break. I'll be a little annoyed if the three breaks. But that's all. And then I get to keep the eights. I think the main thing is keeping the eights here. I, but I... Oh, uh, Ace of Clubs. Mm, I really want to be able to strength it. It'd be so cool to strength. Alright, what does a shit hand like this get? If it doesn't work, then I'll play the straight as a backup. Ah, it's pretty shit. Uh, good news is I got fives. Five should win. Okay. That's good enough for me. Yeah, okay. A three of a kind is actually pretty busted in, in fives. Okay, that's good to know. <laughs> well, well, well. If this run couldn't get even more busted. Uh, let's sell the Neptune. Take a little bit of this. So, um, what sucks here? <laughs> uh, nothing. Nothing sucks. I mean, Hiker is probably the first to go. Because Fib Hacker goes together. My Hiker is my scaling, which is good with Baseball Joker. I guess this is probably the worst. Uh, baseball, then, if I sell Hiker, becomes a times 2.25, which is okay. Um, I would just then copy the trio, or copy Hack. Ah, what was better, actually? Times 3 or another Hack? I also want to lose Baseball, but... Eh... Like, I could lose Baseball Scale with Hiker, but then I lose 2.25. But then I gain Blueprint. I mean, right now, Baseball is worth, um, like, 3 point something something, like 3.375, uh, which is technically better than Blueprint copying Joker. Because, like, what I'm considering is with Blueprint, is, like, early on, I could just Blueprint Hiker and just scale, 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 scale early on, and then eventually shift this over to, like, the trio. Um, you know, for greed. And then I'll basically be doing fine on money. Because, like... Or, I guess, hack? Or, hmm. I think I would, yeah, I would dupe hiker early on. Hiker is not compatible. What?! That's so sad. It doesn't work with Hiker? No. How dare it? Why not? Because, yeah, I was going to, like, anti-6 and 7, dupe Hiker, and then move Blueprint over to the trio. I, I can do pack, which is also fine, less good. 
Um, but, uh, you know, for scaling, but still good. I really kind of want to do it. Kind of want to scale as much as possible. And say, screw baseball card. Because as soon as I sell Hiker, baseball is only a times 2.25. Well, 2.25 versus how much do I think the hiker can get me in scaling? Ooh, how much can it? Because that's that's the a tough part, right? Plus four, well, plus 12 chips per. I've got this. I've got realistically like five more fights before it gets ridiculous. I don't know if I'm going to get enough to offset 2.25. Okay. Yeah, scaling hiker is, you know, great early, but it's not going to be better than 2.25. That's okay. That's okay. Um, that, you know, it's, it's a win, win, win. Everything here is good. I'm not upset. So, thanks for your help. I will buy you, put you here, and take the times three. It's pretty hard to lose now. I'll see if I can get anything with Arcana. D Temperance. Cool. I guess I'm looking around a bit more. Constellation. Hanged Man. Excellent. That's exactly what I wanted. Uh, Constellation. No, that's not necessary. It's probably... Too well, there's the thought is like maybe it does better than baseball card, but... Hmm. Because, like, this is only a times 2.25. How many playing cards do I really think I'm going to use? I mean, maybe enough. Do I think I can use 13? Nah, yeah, let's not overcomplicate things. Hermit, hello. Nah. Oh my god, I keep getting money. How does this keep happening? One more reroll. Alright, we chillin'. I might as well use Venus. You know, because I did play some regular ass three of a kinds. Although, oh, I, I guess I could play a three of a kind against this boss, making a waste of three dollars. Oh no! I'll live. Hanged Man and Fool are about to pop off here. King and Jack go bye bye. And then I dig for threes and fives. So, uh, do I ever lose the aces? Because that's not too bad either. What am I doing with aces? Aces technically should be backups like eights. They just haven't been. So I might just lose them. Or I could, no, I'd rather discard. Aces kind of are also back up, so I could discard these and then try to find something better. Like the Queen 9. Perfect. Excellent. Way better. Way, way, way better. That's an improvement. So now I guess I'm just discarding you. Any 5 or 3. Nice. Alright, so I'm not scaling Hiker anymore. That doesn't matter. It's a full house. Uh, let me di uh, lower down 3 of a kind, I think. Unless, actually, if it would be better for three of a kind to have the level as a backup in the event I can't get a full house. Um, but the odds of having a three of a kind and not a full house are pretty low. I could pair? Wait, do you think a pair would do it? Full house wins anyways, doesn't matter if level goes on. That's kind of also what I was thinking. Wait, two pair. Two pair could be good. <laughs> Two bear has a level. Um, I think I just play full house. Whatever. Yeah, because let's see what this does. Should I really be concerned about the level of full house when I get... 2200! 2.2 2 million. <laughs> what the fuck? 2200,000? Uh, <laughs> you know what I mean. Ramen. Interesting.
Anyway, I'm selling this. I probably should buy the blank in hopes that I get the plus one Joker voucher. I've been playing this a little bit off camera, just like low antis, just so I, when I play on stream, it's not gonna be a low ante. And I got enough blank jokers to unlock the thing. I, I like my discards. Uh, I would have to lose somebody. Hack and Fibonacci are both disgusting, so I guess I don't. So I look for Tarot's strength could be good. What do I have as targets? Fours, multiple fours, and aces. Yeah, strength is great. Excellent. Dig. The f oh, I used this first. I think I'd rather get rid of the trash. And yeah, I can strength aces and don't even need to Hierophant. I, don't, I guess I'm looking for a planet now. Not that planet. Okay, that's fine. I guess I could have double strength, but I could also not. So here we are. Cards previously played this anti are debuffed. All right, that's scary. Um, start with aces and the twos and get rid of kings. Well, that, well, that was easy. All right, so I should play like a lot of twos if I can help it. Try to actually not play threes and fives. Maybe I should actually even skip the next fight. But at least I get to use my Terras here. I think I'm gonna skip the next fight. I could also reroll. But I think I'm safe if I just skip. Yeah, let's just play, play twos. Maybe I could play the three of hearts. Let's see if I can get one more two. Didn't. Eights are also fine. Um, I'm content with going two pairs of eights and twos. By the way, I think that's the first time I've ever strengthened ace into a two. What a historic moment. I could have fished. Meh. Right now, I'm just focused on getting through this. So. Oh yeah, if I play pairs, this has to go here. Which I am doing, of course. It is impossible to not. Unless I think Fibonacci is better. I think actually hitting Fibonacci is better here. Because this is times 2, this is times 1.5. And then I can do something like... Uh... Yeah, because I get the plus molt. Triggering means nothing if I don't get plus molt. It, uh, not nothing, but means almost a little. I'm curious what this scores. Yeah, what, what kind of molt does this get? Bam, bam. Bam, bam. Bam, bam. Bam, bam. All right, so a shit ton of it. Oh, pretty ass, actually. Very sad. I wonder if I would have been better off a baseball card. Okay. Play the threes and then skip the next fight. I'm okay with this. Why would I play the twos here? Copy hack because of this. So I get one more times two versus another times three, but then there's change. I'm a little curious of how this does. Yeah, it's like, I might as well play fewer hands. I think this is okay. I hate that it is threes, but it is what it is. Let's see how this goes. I've never uh, copied hack here. 
Okay, well that broke, so I guess it doesn't really matter if that's showing up in the boss or not. Cool. Okay. Take an Empress. Dig a little. Death is excellent. Okay, I should win pretty much regardless now. I think I'm just gonna skip. Yeah, I'm not scaling anymore. So just get me out of here, yeah? And plus, I got a big hand size now, so there's no way this isn't working out for me. Um, Empress. I do want to discard this nine, but I'll get there when I get there. I already have a full house. Um, I might even just use death now, like on the five of spades. Yeah, maybe I could just do that. It has a lot of extra chips, so I like that one. And I guess I felt a little bad with chips. I don't need more purple seals. I think I just need consistency with fives and threes. Fives and threes are the kings of everything. So I will do that. Bam, bam, bam. And I already have threes. Well, let's discard the two, huh? More temperance. Sure. Is there anything I'm digging for? Steals uh, with planets, I guess. Don't need to play the threes. I'll just play fives and twos. Oh, because it's also do uh, four of a kind, which is... Whoa, four of a kinds are busted. <laughs> uh, I guess I'm playing a four of a kind, huh? Okay, neat. Maybe I should hold on to this for Empress. And this for Empress. Discard these. Play four of a kind. Or five of a kind. Curious. I guess that's good. <laughs> I suppose. Six of a kind. Four of a kind's better. Um, I don't think... Actually, I think the extra five makes five of a kind better still. Even though the base values are different, the extra card makes a huge difference. Like, that'll... The one card alone will definitely cover the gap. I might as well have some five of a kind show up. Yeah, it's two mil. Disgusting. More temperance. Planet cards might consumable here. Give extra molt. Sure, that sounds exciting. Fun. Yeah, get planet cards in the consumable area, if I can help it. <laughs> Hermit's pretty good. Death is better. Hanged Man's really good, too. I actually like Hanged Man the most out of all these. Just get rid of trash. I think Hanged Man's the best. Death is the second best. And just keep thinning to win. My deck is so tiny. 34 cards. I got death as well. Okay, probably just gonna go on this five or something. Get rid of you. High Priest, this could have been kind of funny. Uh, <laughs> There's actually a lot to think about. But I think the consistency is the most important. Take the fives. Looking good. Could have used the four, but I didn't. Get fucked. Meh, meh, meh. Meh. Uh, don't care. And one more. Mars. Okay, nice. Bye. Do not use just to see. Forces one card to always be selected. Does that fuck me? I could always just win with three of a kind, so I don't think so. I can play a straight now. No. I think I just dig. I dig for fives. Dig. Aw, oh, didn't get- Wait, I got a four of a kind. Okay. What is a four of a kind getting out with a Mars hanging out here? And I got another planet. Can I get a hell yeah? <laughs> Four million! Uh, three of a kind isn't bad either, considering I play those. Uh, I've got to do something. I definitely want the chariot. I'll just use this. Get a chariot. Reroll. 
think I actually like that more than Empress. Can I try Blueprint and Hack? You know what? I'll do that next time. Or, uh, against the big blind for the hell of it. And then... Final boss. Actually, it might make sense to... No, this is fine. This is fine. I think I'm okay against the boss blind. Not positive, but I think I am. Okay, that's a lot of fives. Looking good. Can I do better? Got another one. Okay, I just put this on the seven. I think it's still better to play all these. And I will move this to hack just to see what I get. I also have two steel cards, huh? This is, I think, the thinnest I've ever made a normal sized deck as well. It's kind of just the everything build. Bing, 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 bing. Two mil. That is worse. I got Planet X. That's a good one. To hold in hand, I guess. Um, Probably just Arcana Pack and then Dig. Chariot's good, too. Oh, shit. Um, okay, I could finally strength this Ace. And then... I guess that's kind of it. I mean, it's, it's worth the price of admission. Strength the two. Well... If I turn the ace into a two, wouldn't I then want to keep this two to make it more likely that I get stuff with twos? Right? I also have more twos than threes, so if anything, I should be playing like that. This is okay. And steel card is good. Do I think I'll get five of a kind or four of a kind? Hmm. Which do I think I'm more likely to play? I will go with... Use the four of a kind, take chariot, and then go with that. T Emperor. Uh, unfortunately, there is no space. Going big. Strength is cool. I could take the full house just in case. I mean, it's over anyway. Reroll for the hell of it. No! One dollar! One dollar! You know what? Fuck the chariot. We ball. We ball. You're welcome. Holy shit, it worked. <laughs> wow. Oh, and rewarded? Are you kidding me? Wait, Mars might be better here. What the fuck is this seed? Oh, God. Three great ones. Uh, huh. <laughs> uh, do I even have any hanged man targets anymore? And it's not like I'm not thinning for the future anymore. I just gotta win. Especially against this boss. I could also reroll this boss. What boss blinds fuck me? I think I like Hanged Man for versatility. And we'll just play this boss. Alright, let's go. Because now I can, if I have a bad one selected, I can always just Hanged Man. Uh, but here I will discard. So... Oh wait, no, I have a... Uh, you know what? I'm not getting an extra tarot. whoop de doo don't need it. I have everything I want. Unless, if I want to just do it right now. See, I was thinking of a very specific play with Hangman. But actually, no, this is fine. This is fine. Fuck it. Right, that's a two. Got twos and eights. Okay, I guess I'm playing twos. <laughs> um... I guess I'm playing a full house. This is a weird boss. This might just win. <laughs> uh, shit. But I want a five of a kind. How many fives do I have? Six of them? I could discard like this. I could discard like this. A little bit of greed. Everything I draw is pretty much a hit. It is impossible for me to not play a five of a kind. Now the question is... Uh, I got the seal. Okay, actually, you know what then? I did get the red seal. Fuck the five of a kind. I got the red seal. I got a full house. Uh, Hangman's not getting played. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Um, does that mean I put this on hack then? I think yes. Okay, what do we get? <laughs> the big two, the big number. Orange steak ain't got shit on whatever the fuck this run was. <laughs> 18 million. Wow. Well, that means there's only one steak to go. I definitely still feel like I should have won that first ever one, but let's take a look. Oh, got a Radic deck. The next time I will be taking on the final stake in the game, gold stake minus one hand size. No, I'm gonna have to play high card. <laughs> I'm fucked. Uh, but all right, fine. Next stream, I guess I will allow myself to play high cards because <laughs> gold stake mandates it, as that's what it feels like. Uh, definitely ending this on a win. Thank you all for coming out. Taking on gold steak next time beats both orange and purple steak today, so I'm pretty happy about that. I will see you all on two, or Thursday with Islands of Insight stream, and on Sunday with Hollow Knight's Patreon streams, and of course next Tuesday for next Baltro. Bye, chat!